All right, he's live. Uh, can I see some Glove Go Gabalab Pog champs? Can I see some Glove Go Gabalab champs? Let's see it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I fucked it up. Oops. <laughs> yes, we're live. <laughs> what would that even look like? I don't even know. Why am I referencing that? I'm supposed to let that die. Oops. Hi guys, and welcome to the stream. Welcome to Thursday night. Oh, it's gonna be a it's gonna be a fun one. We've got two games to play. It depends on how long we go. We got we're starting with the council, which is uh, well. Actually, hold on. I didn't even tweet yet. I'll be back. What's going to replace Twitter, you know? Yeah. I think eventually we're going to You know how uh, uh hold on, let's wait. Let me let me tweet something first. <laughs> I've been trying to tweet for like fucking 5 minutes. My brain is so scattered. We'll talk about this in a minute. Still smells like a dead animal in here. Now, someone explain to me why sometimes it doesn't. You know what I mean? Why is it sometimes I come down here and it's fine, everything's great, it doesn't smell like a dead animal? And then sometimes I come down here and I have to open a window in the winter. Why? What? What is that? Why is that? <laughs> it's... Because I just showered? No, it has nothing to do with it. And where are my headphones? Oh boy. They're upstairs. God damn it. Just hold on. Alright, we can get started. Let's go. I'm not gonna fucking walk around in circles. Now I can hear. PlayStation 4 is hooked up. The council. Wait, wait, alright, listen. We're gonna play the council. It's a game where George Washington killed somebody. And you have to prove it was him. Or something like that. I have no idea what this game is. Let's go like this. Hey, look at that. The Council. This is a game where people talk a lot. This work is probably fiction, inspired by historical events and characters, events in this game, even those... Warning, regarding the risk of... Uh, that was... You, I didn't give you time to read that. I didn't get any time. I would have liked to have, have read that entire medical document. So this is... Uh, you play as Sherlock Holmes. And then you're, 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 what you're supposed to do is it's like... It's like a telltale game... But it's not, because Telltale games aren't good. It's a little bit better. It's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's as if a Telltale game 
uh, after The Walking Dead won, uh, they made more games that were worth playing. Uh, and delete like Tales from the Borderlands because that's apparently pretty good. Uh, but yeah, yeah. So here we go. Are you ready? Are we ready to enter the manor? There's choices in this game. You're gonna find out who killed Thomas Jefferson. Telltale is bad. No, I, I said I said after. There's the before. Okay, Wolf Among Us was good too. But yeah, those are like really the only two games that Telltale has made besides like Sam and Max 18 years ago. All right, we're gonna play. Save game. The slot is empty. Validate it. it. Looks like Dishonored. Read letters from or address to the other guests to learn more about their motivations and personalities. Parker night at uh, po po Porker Pork and Porker night at the inventory. <laughs> All right, everybody, quick, quiet, quiet. No talking. Oh, <laughs> You're not getting anywhere with this. Oh, it's it's, it's McGonagall. You know, it's McGonagall from Harry Potter too. My dear Sarah, listen. Nothing. Not a sound. No one's coming to save you. Huh. That's what you think. The Golden Order knows exactly where we are. <laughs> By the time your ridiculous secret society <laughs> turns up, I'll be long gone. As for you, <laughs> nothing will remain of your body. It really is Voldemort. If you touch a single hair on my mother's head, I'll skin you alive. Did McGonagall have a son? You know, Louis. Stop it. Let's watch. I have no intention of beating your dear mother. There are more persuasive ways of making you talk. Mm -mm. Oh, he's gonna open the fucking jam. He's gonna open the fucking. He's gonna open the preserves. The strawberry preserves. I intend to get What's back? wrong with me tonight? Stop. Where have you hidden it? Gone, Borshirt. You can't sell that book on the black market anymore. This is finished. We know you're planning on selling it at one of Lord Mortimer's parties. All right? Just tell us who the buyer is and we can make Lord a deal. Lord Mortimer. Lord Mortimer. No Baltimore. idea of the trouble you've gotten yourselves into. Our first choice of the game coming up here, I think. Oh, but you will tell me where it's hidden. I can promise you that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ah! Ooh! Ah. Oh, stop annoying our host, Lily. <laughs> Son. Didn't what happened to you in Rome teach you anything? Oh yeah, I forgot about Rome. Just a few more minutes and my concoction will be ready. Syringe, here it comes. They had syringes back in like the 1200s. This, your bodies will dissolve in less than four hours. You'll see. Come on, give us a classic syringe. Tongues in no time. You know, I have to admit, Mother, the only thing you've ever taught me is that Damn motto of yours. Always remain rational. That's a terrible motto. What? I got it. I've opened the shackles. Draw him got over it. here. I'll take care of him. All right, I got it. What are we gonna do? Von Borchardt. Von Borchardt. Mm hmm. Listen. Let's make a deal. I'll tell you where the book is if you let my mother go free. Oh, what are you playing at? Don't worry, mother. You want to play the hero? You know, I can hear you. Pity you're not in any position to do so. Close up on the syringe. For the last time. Close up on the syringe in his right hand. He's gonna lift it up. He's gonna close up on the syringe. Where is God damn it. Alazif? Act. Let me do this. Trust, Trust her. Me. How, do I have any, Do I have time to do this? Oh. No. Okay. Wait. All right, what, what would I do? I'm gonna play this as, as, exactly as if it was me in this scenario. I'm gonna trust my mother on this one. My mother uh, is a very, very smart person. She's very, very good. She's very trustworthy. I'm gonna trust my mother. Please, be my guest, mother. <laughs> what? Uh. What? Uh oh, syringe! That's a thick syringe. Shoot him. What was that clown music? You reacted perfectly. 
How do you feel? <laughs> oh, go back to that like, cartoon. Here it's come alive, the clowns music. So I can question him after we get back. Pity he's just a middleman. Hmm. Means I haven't finished with this case. Oh, I had a feeling you'd be running off on one of your adventures again, Mother. You know what? I'm warning you. This time, I'm coming with you. Oh. No. Yes. Even though you impress me more and more, I have to do this on my own. Mother, you're no spring chicken anymore. I Come love on. this game Let's already. And don't forget to send our men to tend to Von Borchardt. Will do. I go over there and I just step on his neck. Until I hear gurgling sounds. Well, how fucked up would that be? That'd be a game that would be, holy shit, did he just do that? I read letters from, that was, why did I, that, what a psycho. One moment later, January 20th, 1793, and just a few moments later. Lord Voldemort's Island, off the coast of, hey, look, it's fucking Hogwarts! Hog, Lord Hogwarts' Island. One month, I know it said a month. Just being a little bit of a fucking comedian, right? <laughs> a game by Big Bad Wolf Studio. Well done, Mother. You just had to pick up Bob Burchard's trail on your own, didn't you? You ditch me in Paris with no explanation. Alright, here we go. We hear the, here like the five, the four characters. One of the world-renowned receptions of this Lord Mortimer. And now he writes me to say that you've gone missing on his private island? What is this? Which, what kind way, of world? This is like, like a, a Dark Souls landscape. Island. Everything can, you have to call everything Dark Souls, otherwise you're not a real Twitch TV streamer. Episode 1, The Madman. The Mad Ones. The Council. Why am I playing on the lowest the settings? I'm not. I'm playing on PS4. To lose you. In any case, it is time for you to stop <laughs> the this lowest part. settings. It no longer suits your age. Well, I'm sure it's I'll not the lowest settings. Again. It's on PlayStation 4. Through the cage because I was going to play Burnout Paradise Remastered, but I still am probably. Mystical object that you just can't live without. And tomorrow is a way out, which is on PS4. So excuse me. That I, I'm, I'm preemptively getting ready. I'm not playing it. I got my PlayStation 4 hooked up for the next couple of days. Well now, Duchess, we find ourselves both invited by Sir Hall. Well, how very amusing. Perhaps we have some. Oh, there's um, there's Emma um, there's Emma Watson. One of Lord Mortimer's legendary parties. There's Hermione. Oh no, we have been friends since long ago. Looks but just as like I'm doing her. Some business with Sir Hall. The invitation came from him. Well, I simply can't wait for all the festivities to begin. And you, good sir. What brings you here? Oh, business with Lord Mortimer. I'm here for... I got business to take care of. Lord Mortimer asked me to join him. We have some business to take care of. Oh, how mysterious. Mm -hmm. You adapt quickly, my son. Gonna be the priest. You get along okay. here like a fish in water. Would you believe that we are all here hoping to solve our personal issues? The lights are gonna go out and someone's gonna die. It's gonna be just like crow. Right. I doubt that you came here to look for your mother, your eminence. Anyway, consider yourself fortunate, young man, because there are many who dream of simply one day setting foot on this island, hmm. and only a very few ever Am I make. supposed to be Doc, Indeed. uh, Doc Sherlock? This <laughs> What's his name, Sherlock Holmes? Time here. Indeed, I imagine it must be for, yeah. I'm gonna turn the question back on the, uh, and on the you, Duchess. And you, Duchess? You seem to be quite accustomed to things here. Am I right? I do not think that one can ever get accustomed to what Lord Mortimer prepares for his guests. It's gonna be so, but you so are wacky right. shit. This is not the first time I've been on this wharf. If you've come back again, I imagine you must find it to be of some interest. Mm. Here, everything is possible if you make the right choices. Mm, she's in the game it really too. It is up to you whether you leave better off or not. Remember, everything matters. Please everything matters. Me if you find me overly curious, young man, I did not mean to cause you any embarrassment. It's all right. Come, Duchess. They are waiting for us. We're moving, Monsieur de Richet, if you would like to join us. I'm coming, Duchess. Is that French for Sherlock Holmes? A cardinal? A Duchess? I wonder if all the guests here are this prestigious. If I'd known, I, I would have gone for a better suit. <laughs> ah! <laughs> See? Uh, Voldemort's talking to me. Uh, the snake. Are you right? The scar. See? Harry. Uh, you will. 
lose. I guess that it was just some big joke in the very beginning that this is all coming together. What? A teleporter. Mother? Oh shit, your hand! Oh shit! So? <laughs> okay, it's done. Is this like a Did multiple personality thing? Place? Yes. I made sure no one was following me. Don't worry, Sarah. No one's going to find it. Where's your hand? Are you absolutely sure? Yes, I'm sure. Right. Just one thing left to no, do. No, mother, don't, don't! What happened what? to her hair? <laughs> Have you lost your Why mind? Why did she get like a Sonic There's the Hedgehog no haircut? Way. If you, if you kill <laughs> what happens? Friend, what is her hair? Was her hair always like point, that? My dear, no one must ever. <laughs> Why does she have like again? Johnny Knoxville? But I trusted you. No, Sarah, don't. No. No. <gasps> you can run if you want to, Sarah, but you will pay. <sighs> He's all right. He's okay. You. Uh, Louis, are you alright? You died. What's going on? <laughs> Here, I told it you it was George Washington. I'm sorry. Keep it. Are you better? I'm fine. Don't worry. Yeah, the typical nosebleed. I traveled it's through time. I have to get a nosebleed. That's how you know okay? it's real. Are you sure? Yes. I'm sorry. I'm sure, yes. Fine. I, I can't wait for there to be a, like a, like a somebody's gonna do a comedy game, right? Where there's this time there's a time travel segment and then nose doesn't bleed. And it could be a completely a totally serious part of the story. I definitely have to find mother quickly. And the other character that he's talking to will be like, Whoa, whoa, dude, you're you're you all right, man? Or what? Hey your nose isn't bleeding yet. You sure you you went through back in time? With me. That's a fucking A plus joke. What's happening to me for God's sake? Remove the character. I absolutely need to find you, mother. Is there a way to run? We got gameplay here. Too bad we can't run. We had a good, a good walking Louis, session. A trip, I had something I wanted to ask you, but we didn't happen to run into each other. Yes, Duchess? I'm not sure if you remember, but we've met before. At that time, you were of two minds as to your choice of career. Mm -hmm. Tell me, what have you been up to since? Yeah, we're gonna get something cool. Alright, here's we're gonna pick our class. We can be either the diplomat, the occultist, or the detective. Okay, choosing a class defines your basic skills. The other skills will still be available, but unlocking them will be more expensive. The diplomat shines in society. A talented speaker. He avoids faux pas, and he can convince those with whom he is talking without offending them. Politics is his field. I feel like I could be alright here. Occultist. The occultist is a master of deception. Convinced of the importance of knowledge, he has acquired extensive expertise in science and the arts. Using others to achieve his own ends does not bother him. Okay. Detective. The detective excels in investigation. He is trained to notice every detail in his surroundings, as well as people he questions. A hands-on man, he does not shy away from the direct approach. This is where chat decides. I know what I probably would have picked, but time for chat to decide on the way we're going to take this game. Okay, we got Diplomat, Cultist, and Detective. Detective. Here you go. Bingo. Let's see what you guys want to do. Uh, a Cultist is right off the bat winning. No, oh, detective is kind of coming through here. It's in the title of the stream. <laughs> Nobody wants to be. I was go I was gonna pick diplomat, but uh, fine. We'll do either the hand or the eye. Looks like it's gonna be a cultist. It's not a supernatural occultist. I'm not gonna be able to breathe fire at people, guys. I, uh, this is this is persuading and deceiving people. So if we're gonna play that. I have to be a liar for this. I gotta lie to people a lot. 
All right, that's it. Three, two, one. Pull is over, Occultist. Three points available. Occultist unlocks the Eurydition. Eurydition. Euro Eurodition. Occultism, subterfuges, science, and manipulation skills. You have seven effort points to use your skills. You passed, granted you one skill point in manipulation. You passed, granted you one skill point in psychology. Okay, so, um, get people to act in your own interest. Level one unlocks dialogue options and actions. Occultism, rely on your knowledge of myths, occult and religious symbols, as well as ancient languages. Okay. Be up to date with scientific knowledge and medical techniques. Discreetly steal items. I don't need to know what anything else does. Uh, pick locks and notice fall. Yeah, the, 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 we're just gonna steal everything from the manor. Good. Validate. Oh, no, I was supposed to be talking I to people. I have been involved in all sorts of unsolved Hey, what was your cases? career? Have I you ever heard shit. of the Abbey of Hexham? Uh, vaguely. An ingenious scam involving mass manipulation on a scale never seen before. Don't give away your mm. secrets, dude. You're crazy. There was a cavern under the Abbey right Hey, Spicklace, thanks for the exactly. $50 here. The thanks, wind dude. would blow in through spout. They really should have chosen to get better fucking voice actors' sound. heart. So, thank you so much for the 50 the howling, bucks, dude. The priest hey, called for offerings from the peasants. Big money, big money. And if they brought enough money... I'm guessing the priest stopped the howling. A perfect trick to fool simple souls. Admit it, Duchess. That story a lot kept of money you in Thank suspense, you so much. didn't it? Yes, it did. I'm delighted to find out that you were the young and brilliant French investigator. I, well, I can someone who only remembers What's the bottom the left mean? Vaguely, your Is that my action points? Clear. Well, they say I have the memory of two people. Is there a punch innocent pedestrian Fine, button in Emily. this game? <laughs> Tell me. I was Where are the cars? In case by my mother. You wouldn't know her by any chance. Wait, Louis. We've already met. You do remember me, don't you? Here we go. You've met me, do we? Not at all. It's a lie to her. How could I forget a woman such as yourself? A woman such as me? What a sweet talker you are. Sweet talker. Remind me of how we met? Skills. Your skills have give you access to unique choices and actions at the cost of effort points. It actually is action points. The higher your skill level, the lower the cost is it is in effort points. Browse your skills by using the character tab menu. Okay. A woman such as me, what a sweet talker you are. Remind me of how we met. The most probable place would be Paris. Chat her up. It'll make her lose her train of thought. Pretend to be hard for her to not believe you. <laughs> Emily. It hurts me that you could doubt my sincerity. Yeah, we, that, I thought we'd fine. gotten over that stage by now. <laughs> Don't take it like that, Louis. I was only joking. I thought you were making fun of me. Should we not have used I that? I thought you were someone I could trust. I'm hurt to see that you're still at the stage of testing me. Uh oh, wait a minute. Listen, Louis, I am sorry. The weird guy with the mask on. I really on. didn't want to hurt you. Forget what I just we're said. Just not gonna, it was uh, of me. We're going to acknowledge that so. guy? Let's go with that, then. Didn't see me. Didn't know me. Push any harder and I'll make a fool of myself. Right, time to go. What's to wrong with that guy? Opportunities. Your skills allow you to discover hidden details. Select the object that is most suggestive of the situation in order to discover them. They don't consume effort points. Okay. What? I ask her a question, she answers with another. Is she playing with me? Uh, you have like five seconds. Each person you meet on the island has their own personality. Which makes them vulnerable to certain skills and immune to others. Exploiting their personality is crucial to achieve your personal goals. Stealing everything. Skills used against immunities will not succeed and leave you exhausted. Meanwhile, exploited vulnerabilities will give you one effort point back. Okay. So we uh, review the immunities and vulnerabilities. I guess we can... Everyone has vulnerabilities. We can exploit them. So that that's the middle... PlayStation button. Immunity revealed, vulnerability revealed. Emily, please excuse my insisting, but you still haven't answered about my mother. Okay. Do you know her? You'll see, Louis. Everybody here knows Sarah de Richet. Hmm. Okay. I don't know where we're going like this, Emily, but you're connected to my mother one way or another. And if I can believe my vision, 
You don't have much of a place in her heart. Okay, <laughs> how many fucking game mechanics are in this? You obtain talents when carrying out certain actions. Remember to review their unlock conditions and effects as they offer very interesting improvements. Review all talents in the dedicated tab in the menu. Let's hold on a minute. Okay. Talents. Experienced. Jack of all trades. Occultist mastery. Alchemist. You gain one extra effort point when you use royal jelly. Equipping a manuscript also increases the level of your skill. Machiavellian. You gain one extra effort point when you exploit a vulnerability. One skill point manip you need to use manipulation ten times. Alright, I get let's Let's just play and see how this goes. Because this is intriguing. You know? Uh, what about character? Traits. One point manipulation, one point psychology. Uh, character. Of one map journal. I'm just gonna see how this immu immunity logic. So she's immune to logic. <laughs> I, why? Okay, we need to discover everybody else. So we can't. Don't use logic on her. Use uh, something else. What do I have in my invent? What do I have in my inventory? Handkerchief. Invitation. And. <laughs> Okay. Blinking light. That means I can pick it up. What is it? Royal jelly! Two effort points. So we gotta hold on to these. These are like outlast batteries. Is there a run? There has to be, right? I, need to, I gotta examine everything. Look, there's more shit here. More royal jelly. Oh, that would've been bad if I missed all this. Wait, what's the turn the brightness up? Audio and subtitles controls. Shit. This is a dark, dark game. Alright. Um, I don't really want to go all the way back here, but I kind of have to. Loot the chest, can you? Alright, we're good. Alright, sprint. Come on, what's the... L3, like, just like Call of Duty Sprint. Chest. Guys, everyone's like, just just wait till we get to have like a tea kettle we can smash into somebody's head, you know? Like, just just wait. It's worth. It'll be worth it. Once we get the first head smash tea kettle move, I, everyone's Good gonna evening, be very sir. very. May much. I ask your name? I didn't even go this way. Louis Moras de Richet, Monsieur de Richet, delighted to welcome you among us, sir. You must be Sarah de Richet. This is Vega from I Street Fighter. I must tell you, we are doing our utmost to find your mother as quickly as possible. Looks exactly like him. All right, where? What do you, uh, where is he? I have an appointment with Lord Mortimer. Would you be so kind as to lead me to him? Unfortunately, sir, I cannot. I don't know exactly where my master is. But rest assured, sir, everyone is waiting for you at the manor. Sir Holm insists on welcoming you in person. Since your mother went missing, everyone has been concerned about finding her. Okay. Who is Sir Holm? A close friend of Lord Mortimer. <laughs> Here comes the PlayStation rest assured, sir, it won't take us long to find your revered mother. Indeed, we are searching the Ks again because lights were seen at the wharf just last night. Interesting. Where we are now? Indeed, sir. According to our information, lights were seen in the middle of the night, sir. After verification, none of the guests seem to have left the manor last night. We think that perhaps <laughs> like sir's my... mother was here. Every day at the same time, man. I gotta get, I gotta get, hold on, wait, wait, wait. Your mother was here. Have you found anything here? I don't I can't lie, I can't, are there any witnesses? Did anyone see anything else? Unfortunately not, sir. Only lights were seen by servants of the manor, sir. And as <laughs> sir. I was saying, sir, as I was saying, all sir. the guests were asleep. Sir. And no one seems to have noticed anything at all. Sir. We seem to have found an object that would appear to belong to sir's mother. Sir. A handkerchief. So handkerchief is embroidered with the initials S D R. We came to the conclusion that they are the initials of Sir's mother. <laughs> the initials of Sir. I have orders to give it to Lord Mortimer as soon as I see him. <laughs> I know Mortimer, Lord Rickard, Lord Rickard, and Lord Mortimer. War for nothing. I've got to find out what the hell she was doing here. Where exactly did you find the handkerchief? 
On the landing dock, sir. The one you arrived by. Hmm. Will you give me that handkerchief? These are locked. Give it to me. Pass me the handkerchief. But, but, sir, my orders were to give it to my master. Yeah, he's a servant. Are you refusing to give me my own mother's personal belongings? Vulnerability. Even though she was greatly looking forward to meeting your master. He has She's to listen missing. to you. And you seem incapable of finding her. Oh, but, sir, please. And to top it all off, you refuse to give me the handkerchief that she so often let me use? Do I deserve such little consideration in your eyes? Is that what you wish me to report to your master? No, uh -uh. certainly not, sir. Please forgive me, sir. I have been such an idiot. Here you are. Idiot. Thank you. Mother's handkerchief. It is indeed your handkerchief, mother. So what was the point of that? I have to come I, uh, here for a specific reason. I need to know what it is. Let's think. What could she finally. be doing out here on this wharf? There's a sprint button, I told you. Character revealed. Servant. Now let's look at him. Vulnerability manipulation. They all wear a mask. It is a recurring subject of conversation among the guests. No one knows the true reason. Huh. That is interesting. Okay. Call of Duty. Looks like the barrel's been broken for quite some time. <laughs> we have to go. We, 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 we might have to go around. For, I gotta look for clues about my mother. That's why I'm not allowed to go any further. A wooden floorboard. Uh, I can tell you. Yeah. Why? Why, why do we not have question? <laughs> question the wooden floorboard. Hmm. Where did you come from? Probably comes from this part of the wharf. The wood is slightly eaten away, of course, but it still would have been fine if it weren't smashed. Yeah, the reason why all the servants wear masks is because it's a way for the company that made the game to not need to animate the servants. That's the real reason. Pretty clever reason, too. All right, so this is broken. Somebody stepped on this. Gate, open the gate up. It's locked. Let's open it. Locked. I'll never get it open barehanded. Well, oh, wait a minute. I have the skill of the occultist. Open that lock. Ah, there we are. Interesting. We got a barrel here. Hmm. This wharf is used as storage for a lot of barrels. Uh, examine the barrel. Uh huh. What have we here? It's cannon powder. Ooh. Stand back. Uh, examine the cannon powder. Hmm. The powder is wet. Not surprising, given the dampness of the dock. It's unusable now. This isn't gonna explode. I don't know what the person who left this barrel like this had in mind, but it's a waste. Okay. Anything else you want to tell me? Great. Honey. Got some honey, some royal jelly. This looks like a pistol case, but it's empty. I don't know if this has anything to do with you, Mother, but if it does, at least now you're armed. Well, didn't we see her shoot somebody? Just like in my vision. And none of it's telling me anything useful. Apparently, someone on this island has gone through a whole lot of trouble okay, to I got arm the clues. themselves. I really must find you, dear Mother. And Look for more too. clues or go to the manor. All right, we're going to the manor. Let's, 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 I don't need any more clues. I'm just going to blindly accuse somebody anyways. Yeah, let's get to that manor. All right, can we do this now? Wait, 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 what? What was that? Oh, I have to, I, have to, I can't walk up. There's a loading screen to walk up the stairs. Don't blindly, uh, sir. How did Mortimer manage to build his manor at the top of a rocky outcrop? I'm, I'm intrigued so far. <laughs> I have to 
play a cutscene. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Should we, should we take off, like, the gold foil? Should we unwrap the chocolate bar here? We go, knock, 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 things gonna slide open. Yes? Who is it? God damn it. You had a you had an opportunity to make, like, a Wizard of Oz thing here. How hard would you guys laugh if I just started tapping square and it was like, there would be like a three punch combo in the game for no reason. Then it would be one of the best games ever. Zeus. Whoa. Impressive. Ah, my son. When do we get to have the dinner? For you. What can I do for you, your eminence? I wanted to ask you. You are the son of Sada Dedice, aren't you? You see, your mother and I were supposed to meet here on this very spot. I was supposed to hand her a very important envelope, but I Fucking haven't cool seen joke. her. If only Mother had told me why she was coming here. Persuade anyway, him to give me the letter. I ought to take the envelope. It might have something to do with her disappearance. Okay, I'm listen. Can confrontation help. start. You can always give it to Three me. Three blunders left. During a confrontation, you have to go through several steps while being as persuasive as possible. Confrontations have consequences on the rest of the story, so don't hesitate to use your skills. Each confrontation displays an interface showing how much the person you are talking is convinced. Thank you, my son. I bear that right, in mind. Scream in his face immediately. I'd rather deal with her directly. Don't take it personally. Okay, Would step you one. happen to know if your mother has arrived yet? That's a block. That's a blunder, though. Like, that's not gonna work. <laughs> Listen, trust me, sir, and give me the letter. I'll take care of everything. I appreciate your devotion, my son, um, but no thank you. Being hasty. I knew, it was gonna, rarely, I knew so that was gonna anything. happen. By the way, your eminence, I wasn't aware you knew my mother. Ah, uh, if you only knew I knew it was son, a fucking blunder. Hold your mother in the highest regard. She has rendered great service to the church, and her help is invaluable. I hope that you will follow in her footsteps. It's like trying to get into the club with no invite. Only she had told me where she was headed. Nonetheless, our exchanges have always been discreet, and I should like them to remain as such. Hmm. If your mother wishes to speak to you about us one day, I will not mind if she does so. That is commendable, but... As we work together on a daily basis, it is surely just an oversight. Mm -hmm. Most certainly. Step two. Uh, you said you work together. What do you do me and exactly? The mom? What do me and mom do? Here we go. Uh, we are members of the Golden Order. See, we're the members of the Order of the Phoenix. I only got... Uh, our business is confidential. Be it mother or myself, our motto has always been discretion in all things. And to promise to never betray a word of honor. Was your secret safe with mother? It will be even more so with me. Oh, yes. You have convinced me. The straight. mystery with which your mother manages her business proves that she carries your motto close to her heart. I your get, words I, seem sincere, my I got son. two blunders remaining. All the same. It bothers me to see you in a quandary, your eminence. Is there any other solution? Look, if it's of any help, you can always leave your envelope with me and I'll give it to her as soon as I see her. Ah... Uh, I uh, hesitate. Was he holding his Up hand? Until now, we have always dealt with her in person. Oh, that's a that ring. has always been successful. All right, we gotta get this right. Do you think I should give it to you? I only have one energy left. I don't even... All right. Pretend I don't want it. Yes, I'll give it to her. You can... Shit. Can I eat, any, eat some food? All right, first, let me just, like, let me mow down on some honey first. Hold on, can you hold that thought, Father? Let me just drink some honey. How do I... There it is. Look, you seem hesitant. The simplest thing to do is just to give it to her when Manipulatable. you see it. Manipulatable. After all, it's not that urgent. Mm -hmm. Yes. I mean, yes, it's urgent. I mean, what if we don't find each other here on the island? Though I'm going to be like the creepy guy. 
I might not be staying for very royal long. jelly down his throat before I talk hmm. to people. What to do? Imagine taking like the, that honey, the bear honey thing, just Come turning on. it upside down before a conversation. Letter for crying out loud. I cannot run the risk alone. I am going to trust you. You seem like an honest man. Got it. Bingo. Listen to me, my child. If I give you the letter, can you promise me before oh, Jesus, God? Jesus, promise before that God. No one other than your mother will read it. Last step. For the last step of a confrontation, you must convince the person you are talking to by giving a positive answer. If you give a bad answer, the step will repeat itself until either you give a right one or you have no blunders left. I don't think I want to tell the guy I don't believe in God. Um, listen. Yeah, no worries. Don't worry about it. I swear by the almighty God to honor the promise that no one but my mother shall cast her gaze upon your letter. Good. <laughs> listen, let's stop there. I'm going to tell you a secret. All right, Palpatine. Your mother and I are organizing the escape of a large number of French priests who face a massacre organized by the cursed Republican tribunals. Oh, those cursed the Republicans. Is literally being bled like a beast. Without your mother, hundreds of men of the cloth would have gone to the guillotine. She has made the services of your order available to us by organizing the priests safe. Wait, why is the priest the upset about the Republicans? Even if she does not share be the all way around? convictions. She always provided assistance. Oh, pol and get I'm, political. You can be proud to be her son. Be it only for her sake. Always respect your name. Here, <laughs> the letter I spoke of. It includes a list of about 15 names ready for departure. Be quick. Remember to tell her when you see her. <laughs> That time is short. <laughs> French Republicans. Well played. I know, it's a I'll joke. I'll decide later when I'm alone whether to look at what it can I'm going to read the letter right now. Haven't you ever seen Game of Thrones? Many clues and items are hidden. Some of them will have an impact on your adventure, so do not hesitate to look for them. Open it now. Open it in front of him. I don't care. Open the damn thing. Oh, I can't. Whatever. Read it out loud. Go over to where he's standing and open it and read it. Alright, this game says explore. So I'm gonna explore. There's a map of Europe. Interesting. This is interesting because this is back when uh, this is back when Italy was apparently like connected to the it, the, the boot was all the way to the right. It's moved about 6,000 miles to the left since then. This is like uh, Pangea, right? This is like See, Spain is, is connected to Africa now. That's interesting. See it there? That's interesting stuff. Back to uh, Pangea. <laughs> Sounds about right. <laughs> Lives of the Noble Greeks and Romans by Plutarch. They tell me to read books, Biography right? of the Great Men. Flip through it. Easy. Don't need it. No, no difficulty. Open we need to learn, Brutus's remember? Page. Caesar, stabbed by multiple blows at once, sees Brutus raise the dagger on him. Then, covering his head with his robe, he delivers himself to the arms of the conspirators. Steel. Nice family. Let's keep it. Might come in handy someday. Yeah, let's steal it. Take everything. Manuscripts allow you to educate yourself during the adventure. At the start of each quest, you can choose what to read and gain permanent skill points. Find your manuscripts by using the inventory tab. Parallel lives. All right. Any more things I can take? Where are the stray forks, knives, and plates that I can just pick up for no reason? Like in Skyrim and all those games like that. Devil's Thorn. Devil's Thorn grants you the exalted state. You temporarily see the immunities and vulnerabilities affecting a dialogue choice in a conversation. You cannot carry more than five. Interesting. Keep looking around. Can we get more items? I no. thought my chimney was big, but this one is beyond belief. Which, uh, who it's is this? the least one can say. I've been longing for a warm fire for ages. 
since I set foot on the island, I haven't ventured more than two yards away from it. Have you also just it's arrived? Gap to oh, late morning, I'd say. Louis, come join us. <laughs> Monsieur, God damn, no, it's not. That's... Monsignor, His Eminence, Cardinal Piaggi. Cardinal Piaggi. He joins us straight from Rome. Oh, just call me Your Eminence. It's simpler. Mr. George Washington. George Washington. Oh, it President is! President of the United <laughs> States of America. Delighted at last to make your acquaintance. It actually is. Pleased to meet you, Mr. President. I thought that was just a big Louis joke. Grass Why is the president? Why it is George is Washington here? Young man, let's keep it simple, please. Let us forget our fancy titles. Nice to meet you, Louis. I should imagine you never thought you'd be in such company. Oh. I must admit that I, I didn't. All right, it actually it's is the him. first time that I've ever met so many illustrious personalities. And you haven't seen anything yet. Generally, when Lord Mortimer organizes one of his receptions, there are over a dozen people. Oh, there will be. They can't all be here yet. And you'll see, most of the time, there's only the upper crust. And I noticed you were already getting to know his eminence at the entrance. It's the perfect place to build up a network. Cool. What were you talking about, if you forgive my indiscretion? Right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna play to George Washington. I like George Washington, I think. What were you talking about? My mother, a letter. Let's avoid the subject. About the sur surprising main door. We were talking about my mother, just chatting about it. At the risk of disappointing it. you, we weren't conspiring in our corner, sir. His eminence was simply yeah, telling I, me I that said at the very beginning that George Washington was the killer, and I stand by that. How much he held her in high esteem. It so happens that Monsieur de Riche's mother is to join us. Oh, pity. No scrumptious gossip or juicy tidbits. Why is it George Washington? Or even money matters, but you'll see. It will come. Despite all the goodwill in the world, you can't stop people scheming left and right around oh, here. Speak for yourself, sir. <laughs> Why is George Washington a bumbling, goofy guy? Well, my friends, do any of you know the reason why we're here this time? Seduce Not George Washington. Slight. I'll try. As for me, I've been invited by Sir Horn, a close friend of Lord de Mortimer, but uh, I do not know the reason why. You see, Louis, every time Lord Mortimer organizes yeah, a why reception, does it look like George Washington got his face smushed in a door? With all the guests. During which Did he look like that? Remake the world. Accompanied by gallons of absinthe and cussing, I'll leave you to imagine the result. So, if I understand rightly, Monsieur de Richer, you've come out here to join your mother. For what reason, exactly? Invent... I want to, uh... Okay, what would George Washington want to hear? He was a he was a pioneer, right? To invent something like you, Mr. President. See, I'm, I'm here as I'm a result manipulating the president of the United States right Two now. Two members of the same family here. That is rare. I'm using my you know what they say. Ultra manipulation you can pick techniques. Your nose, but you can't pick your family. <laughs> <laughs> Did George Washington just really laugh at a pick your nose joke? Seriously, though, I know your mother well. Stay behind with me afterwards. Yep. And we'll take a moment to speak about her. I absolutely will. What? Oh, his mouth. What? What? It's it reported as just hi. Good evening, my friend. Holy shit! That's the man for my vision. An urgent case has delayed our host. <laughs> Who is that? Mortimer. He can't be present this evening, and he sends his <laughs> golem with makeup Bob. on. He's asked me here, and he hasn't even turned up. Great start. Do you know that man? Sir Gregory Holm, an English aristocrat. <laughs> it's very the influential. He's also close to Lord Mortimer. So <laughs> don't be surprised <laughs> if he acts like he's at home. Ah, uh, yes, Mortimer Snow. And now, smoke. my dear guests, a light meal is served in the small salon. For those who would like to, you're invited to follow me into the next room. My dear fellow, you <laughs> must have read my thoughts. I shall follow. We'll have to be careful not to make too much noise. One of Lord Mortimer's guests is relaxing. Oh, we shall be quiet. Don't take it the wrong way, Sir Holm, but I have already eaten. Thus, I shall be happy to remain by the fireside. So he's just if like the funny mind, fat Gregory, guy that eats I a lot. I should like to keep Mr. Washington company. No, go. You Please leave. feel at home. How do I convince her? I'm going to convince her to leave. If I stay with Washington, we'll be able to speak about my mother. But on the other hand, I'd like to learn more about this home. I saw. No, we're sticking with uh, George Washington. Stay and listen to Washington. See what Washington has to say, sir. If you don't mind, I shall stay here. 
Do exactly as you please, young man. We didn't fail to seduce George Washington. He's please, right here. Thank you for staying. Just like you, when I arrived this morning, I found out that Sarah had gone missing. I know your mother well. Don't worry. Emily is from the English branch of the Golden Order. The Order and of the President Phoenix. Washington is in fact the, the leader, leader of the, the Order of the Phoenix. <laughs> I, I didn't this know. This is the real Harry Sorry Potter timeline. Sorry to have made you wait, but I didn't want to speak in front of the others. Those you did death well. Eaters really hot. Secrecy Giving us real and nutrition. discretion are the pillars of our organization. If I can help in any way at all, please don't hesitate to ask, my lad. And if you have any other questions, now's the time. Tell me about this Mortimer. Where does Emily know my mother from? Tell me more about this Mortimer. My mother has always had a fascination for Lord Mortimer, but has never wanted to tell me why. Lord Mortimer is a remarkable man. He's wealthy. Stop with the Harry Potter friends. The very highly placed. Oh, Your mother we're on is it. The head of That's all I got right now. France. It doesn't surprise me that he asked her to come. Lord Mortimer greatly contributed to financing my electoral campaign, for example. But I want this to be clear without ever seeking to gain an advantage. And that is to his credit. Okay. Yes, you can trust him. He will do everything in his power to help you find Sarah. Mr. Washington, you seem to be very familiar with my mother. When did he see her for the last time? How did he know? Come, uh, when when did you, when did when you did last, you last see speak to her? Philadelphia. Collusion. <laughs> 15 years ago. George Washington Sarah colluded. Sarah often went back and forth between France and the United States. Yes, I remember those <laughs> days. I didn't see her too often. <laughs> right. Would it be too much if I asked you a few more questions? Uh, fucking Not my internet all. sucks. Good. God damn it. But Why? I can't promise I'll remember everything. May I ask, when you saw each other, what did you talk about? I, my politics are locked. He doesn't like that. Or the mysteries that surround us. My mother has always been fascinated by strange powers. Did she talk to you about anything like that? Yes. Her facility for discerning truths from rumor served me well. I can't wait to the end Such of the uh, as this preventing game. massacres, like the one at Salem, from happening again. Where? No, or I mean, like, that's not... I mean, you can take that anywhere you want. Without <laughs> I was going to say something. Oh, what I can't wait, but... To say uh, I'll just tell you. Keep an open and logical mind? Yes, that's it. Thank you, sir. <laughs> I was hoping to speak with Lord Mortimer. Ooh, I found out. At least now I have some information, thanks to you. I repeat, Lord Mortimer is a man of his word. You I was going to say, I can't wait till the end of this game and I am when George Washington has the gun in his hand and he kills you. Concern. But I stopped, and like that could still be used in context. I wonder if Mother is still on the island. Could she not have taken a boat and left? <laughs> I don't see how. No vessel can move closer than 200 yards. Dab yellows. Washington? Not to mention the permanent presence Why are you guys, what are you dabbing? Why are you dabbing? There is one strange thing, I grant you. This I didn't even see it. Did he dab? The size of Delaware, he did not, did he? despite that, no one has been able to locate your mother. So my mother still must be on the island. Don't worry, Louis. I'm sure nothing bad has happened to her. That's a guarantee. Yes, something I, I has hope not. Terribly has happened to her. Careful, they're coming back. Hi. Nope, two new characters. That's Draco Malfoy. Well, I am. And of course, with all this splendor. But don't spend too much. <laughs> and of course, his trusty Mr. companion, Washington the Mountain. Idea. Or you'll lose your pretty accent. <laughs> <laughs> You seem to be intrigued by that statue. Absolutely. It is remarkable. Lord Mortimer is fond of atypical works of art. I won't disguise the fact that I find it all a little megalomaniacal. But I must say, he does have some outstanding pieces. Ooh! The penis or the... The penis. Yep, got it. The statue is impressive, and so are the paintings. <laughs> so is penis. <laughs> oh no, it's that weird one. Lord Mortimer has very good taste. The weird the guy, the guy eating the, the person. To express it. No, I That's see in every I horror game ever made. Sir. Yes, in my spare time. Yet, I couldn't tell you who the artist of that painting there. Yeah, that's 
Welcome to I every horror game. Look inside the, the person's theme, study, and that's in there. The style intrigues me. Saturn devouring his son. Oh well, you wouldn't know. And the artist is none other than Lord Mortimer. I thought for a long time that the painting wasn't finished, but my old friend assured me it was. Still, there's no accounting for taste. Not very conventional, but it sure does hold your attention. You will find that Lord Mortimer is not what one would call conventional. It's Cronus. Sir de Richet. Sir Hall, who was that young lady with you? Elizabeth <laughs> Adams, Mr. President. She would have liked to have stayed with us, but the poor thing is exhausted. <laughs> Elizabeth Adams. Oh, my stomach. Ow. Miss Adams that is extreme. here to rest. Oppor what? There was an opportunity? I've already come across her in the corridors. She arrived a few days ago. I perceived her, but we weren't introduced. That's like a good. Rest assured. That face She's not here for the same reasons as yourselves. Yada yada. Consequently, I'm counting on your mm. indulgence. What did he say? I can't believe it. On that note, it's very late. You what the fuck? Exhausted. I don't have any of these moves. The servant will accompany you to your rooms. All right. Character revealed, Elizabeth Adams. This is finally the dinner is going to start. He, the guy's going to come out. The eccentric billionaire is going to come out and go. Gentlemen, I bid you all good night. Here it comes, Mr. President, Your Eminence, Duchess. He's clap his hands twice. We'll have the same rooms as usual. You, Monsieur de Richet, will find your room at the end of the corridor. Yeah, I'm well, waiting for the guy to come up, clap twice, and be I like, "Welcome." Tired. I am festivities. off to my bed. See you in the morning. Good night, sir. I shall do likewise. Louis, I shall see you in the morning. Sleep Your up. hair is awful. Good night. I'll see you tomorrow. Who's got worse hair, oh, me or her? Man. It's been quite a day. Right. Where is my room? Go to your room. <laughs> they just told me, but I don't remember. Can I start smashing vases? Pick up the telephone. It's an old school telephone. Can I just go in people's rooms? Hello? Open it. Monsieur Napoleon Bonaparte. Napoleon's in this game. Are you kidding me? Okay, I can't wait to see Napoleon. I'm so excited now. Who's in here? Jacques Peru. Jacques Cousteau? The fucking famous fisherman? Who else is in this game? How many odd cartoon characters are in this game? It's got so many characters. A few leaves out of an old encyclopedia. Oh, Go to your room. Hold on. Golden elixir. Golden elixir cures all your negative alterations. You cannot carry more than five. Interesting. More. I'm, 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 I'm gonna need these items. The Devil's Thorn. To be used to uncover the best disguised traits. So I can use that. Do I have to use that during a conversation? And that will show me what I need to know? Or what? It's up here. No, can't go there. Who's in here? Me? That's not me? Whose room is this? This is empty. Oh, monsieur. Johann von Wunder. I don't know who that is. Wait, what's my name? My name's like like Harry Richter or something, right? Harold Richter? What's this guy's full name? Any more items? <laughs> I'm getting lost. I'm getting lost in this house. I can't go in that one. What am I gonna, 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 gonna witness the murder? Nope. Oh well. Uh. <laughs> yeah, there are a lot of chairs here. Me? Is this my room? President George Washington. President George Washington. George! Do I, do I, do I get a bunkmate with uh, George? Come on, let me be neighbors with George. Do I get to sleep on the couch? I don't understand. Me? I forgot what my hotel room key was.
Is this me? Monsignor, his eminence Cardinal Piaggi. No, this is Piaggi's. I don't know. That's not my room. Is this my room? Huh, that's me. Harry Richter, there it is. Uh, hello? Right. So what shall I do with this letter? It might be about my mother's disappearance. But if I open it, I'll be betraying Piaggi's trust. Who gives a shit? It's your mother. What I do? Open... Wait, open the letter without breaking the seal. Yeah, uh, yep. So, it really is a list of French countrymen. Piaggi wasn't lying. Wow. Nice room. Mortimer sure oh, doesn't do things swanky. halfway. <laughs> We're gonna bring that one back. Oh, look at this little swanky room. No, this room sucks. I don't want this room. Oh my god, get me out of this room. You don't want to sleep here. Oh, wow, what a great cozy room. Mm-hmm. And oh, yeah. I can't wait to lie down and stare at these images. The Conversion of St. Paul by Caravaggio. It's incredible. It doesn't look like a copy, but I was sure the original was in Rome. Where's my bed? Was your room comfortable? Did you like the painting of the person being eaten? It's art. Isn't it great? Caramel water. Caramel water gives you the focus state. Your next skill you use will cost no effort. Good. Great. Honey. Some more honey. Anything else? Uh, collector's coins. Okay. So where's my bed? Oh, this, uh, this is definitely somebody else's room. Collecting coins. There we go. God, get these paint. Can I cover these up with some tapestry or something? Imagine waking up in the middle of the night to go to the bathroom and you turn the corner groggy and you see one of these images. I wouldn't be able to go back to bed. <laughs> you just have a huge black spot in your vision. <laughs> just right in the center of my vision is a huge, just gray spot. Alright, success. I went up to the manor. Okay. I did not find all the clues about my mother on the docks. I didn't pick up the book on the quay. I could have joined Sir Home in the small salon. I could have made an unexpected encounter. Off the coast of England. Leveling up. Skill points. Uh, yes. Level two. Discreetly steal items. Everything we want. Skill use is free. Level manipulation. Let's get that to level two. Um, probably should do like politics or something, right? I got how many points do I have? One point with politics, logic, vigilance, questioning, psychology. Diversion, linguistics, politics. Especially grasp with it. I want, I want George Washington to like me. I'm gonna put like one point into politics. Okay. I'm okay with this. Your next reading. Equipping manuscripts. Here you can choose what to read during the uh, adventure. Give you different skill points. Got it. Alright, so we got uh, one point to occultism. This one, I would assume, is probably one skill point in occultism. One skill point. Yeah, I'll read this shit. That's all I can do is start it. Cool. There we go. Let's keep going. More fucking Harry Potter nightmares. Two new characters. Hmm? Checkmate. Your turn? The servants are not very efficient. Durache can't be far away. They'll find her soon. Their search time is restricted given that they must keep an eye on Adams. I can take care of her, you know. 
Yes. Well, in any case, I do thank you for bringing her to the island. <laughs> From what I've understood, the search of De Richet's room hasn't turned up any results. What are they looking for? Not yet, no. But we've put her son Tuck in. your shirt all the way Perhaps in or not at all, dude. Something. What is this halfsies bullshit? That might come in handy. Louis grows impatient at not yet having met the famous Lord Mortimer. He will meet him tomorrow. Oh, okay. what a pity to lose a knight at the start of the game. Hello? Are you waiting for someone? A I young French service. soldier. During our game of chess. Don't worry, Gregory. The game. What monster are we gonna get for scanning this? I'll have one of my men escort you back. There's Napoleon. Don't trouble yourself. I know my way out. Ah, good evening, gentlemen. Please forgive me for this late no. hour. It is never too late. And it's we Napoleon, have much right? To discuss. One last room. <laughs> is that Napoleon? Don't worry. Our games always seem to end like this. Or always start like this. Come, come. Take a seat, my friend. All right. That was him. Good thing we got the glimpse of Napoleon. Napoleon Bonaparte. Short. He was he was as tall as this guy. Here we go. Con this the confrontation. This is where George Washington dies. Nighttime stroke, Mr. President. There's nothing like it for a good night's sleep. Do not hesitate to ask a servant to show you back. Let's keep doing this. The corridors seem quite safe. Peppermint, lime flower, and valerian. My miracle remedy when one can't get to sleep. A very good night to you, Mr. President. Thank you. No, I'm and the to servant. you too, sir. This is going to be one of those weird things where the servant thinks he's me and I'm the servant. Nose bleeds. That's how you can tell. I'm coming. <laughs> well, that's a fortune. <laughs> I did. Dear Monsieur de Richet, <laughs> please excuse me, but I am unable to join uh -huh. you at present. However, rest assured that we are doing all we can. Does he find a key that will help you to retrieve the personal effects your mother left behind? By the way, Mr. Mortimer. Inspiration of St. Matthew, or right, Matthew writing his gospel, dictated to him by voices. I'm coming. See, I just said it now. Inferno by Dante. No, Dante's Inferno. Abandoned I remember that book. hope all ye who enter here. Lovely lectures Mortimer's giving to his guests. You know that was Very a series jolly. of three books? Oh, shit, I don't want to leave Excuse me. me. Am I bothering you? No, no, not in the least. Is something wrong? I'm going to need your help. Do you remember the young lady we spoke of in the hall? Oh, shit. Uh, sure, yeah, I do. Elizabeth Adams. Home introduced her to us. Yes. <laughs> I'm bothering you. Well, she is the daughter of my friend, the President vice president, president John Adams. But she is supposed to be dead. Yeah, that's bizarre. Fair enough. Good heavens. I was present at her funeral. It is disturbing indeed. Yes. I need to make sure it's her. That's where you come in. Get a DNA I sample. I want you to distract Elizabeth while I search her room. Oh, and please, George. And my hands on some important George, this is bullshit. At least you just I want to be like so. a creep. I don't know about this, George. Elizabeth is in the small cellar. You distract her. I, I, I might need to make sure it's her. I just need By ten rifling minutes. through all of her shit. But my vision is I just need ten minutes. Two men nearby discussing very important issues, and one of them looks much like Mortimer. Washington is very kind, but I came to this island for my mother, not for his ghost stories. Hmm. Uh. I 
do want I do want George to like me. And we need to, we need to have like a somebody on the inside, you know what I mean? Yeah, I, I want me, George is probably Thank like you, one friend. of the George, I I got a feeling George is probably one of the other good guys. Downstairs in the story. as long as possible. She must not return to her room. Trust me. Germa saves Washington. America. Lady Adams is in the small salon. I better hurry. I don't know where that is. The small salon downstairs. What the fuck is that? I can barely navigate the side rooms, let alone find the salon in this guy's gigantic richy rich mansion. Salon. Is, what, is that next to the bowling alley, or is that uh, across from the arcade? I don't know what that is. God damn it. I hear voices. Steal. Take it. Take this. Take it. Take it. Oh, what? <laughs> no, don't sit down. I thought I thought that was part of it. That's not the salon. This is the giant fucking cartoon fireplace. Go. There are there's people talking outside. Okay, where the fuck do I have to go from here? Straight ahead. My son. Oh, you are a godsend. What's the matter, Your Eminence? I believe that Miss Adams may be in danger. Mm -hmm. What do you mean? Do you hear that? She is being manhandled in this small salon. What? By whom? I don't know exactly. Uh, what are you, why are you just listening? French Get the fuck in there. Are you crazy? Miss Claude, I'd say he's a member of the French Revolutionary Government. You should do something, my son. What, why don't you do something? Get out of the Shit. fucking way. I was supposed to make sure Adams wouldn't go back to her room. Don't worry, Your Eminence. I'll take care of it. Probably nothing to worry about. Do you want me to call for help? Please don't do anything. I'm sure Holy with shit, the will, this good will, everything will work out fine. Don't go and wake up the whole manor, please. <sighs> Thank you, my son. What if he's an old my man? God, he could just go in there with a cross and just start saying shit, and everyone would listen to him for a minute. That's what we have. That he, you could do that. Who do you think you are? Forgive uh, there are multiple paths to reach your objective. It may be a good idea to think twice before embarking on the first path you come to. Me, sir. If we were in France, I'd have sent you to the guillotine for what you just said. Please, just that's let a, me go that, back to my That's not Napoleon. Room. That's like... That's like M. Bison. Hey, you. Stay out of it. This is no, not M. Bison. What's his name? I'm the guy that does the cross the map. Uh, Raiden move. What the hell is going on? Huh? I don't think you know who I am. Stop. Why is he wearing a you got the best I, I pie in the fair you. contest? Don't hit me, please, sir. Pinned to his Shit. shirt. If I step in, Adams might just run back uh. to her room. And if I do nothing, yes, Washington will have enough time to search, but this girl's gonna uh. suffer. What the fuck is it? What should I do? Uh. Alright, I gotta step in here. Let her go! Huh? Stay out of it, boy! No, don't run away though. Hold on, wait, 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 before you go! Oh, no, she's gonna that? run in and see a Washington. I told you to mind your own business, boy. If you think you can start Washington's forth, rifling through her shit right away, now. You're out of your mind. Give me okay, one good reason fight. not to knock you down. Punch him. I'll do the, take the first punch. Shit. Oh, I damn it! I can't do it. You're not back in your slum now. Oh, I could have punched you him in the face. Lord Moore's home. I suggest you think carefully about what you're going to do. No, no, Don't that's think not a you're getting away with it that easily. I'm sick of all these toffs. If we were in Paris, I'd send you all to the guillotine. And on top of it all, a woman telling me how I ought to behave? I won't stand for it. I really do like the okay, French accent okay. on you here. Wait a minute. What? Don't tell me you're going to defend you me. You have an idea how hard it was to cook that pie? It was blueberry first place. Don't you see it, you fucking idiot? What? Cat got your tongue. That's okay. 
That's not a blunder. I get the you're trying to put one over on me. If that's the case, you're making a big mistake. Shit, where's my I, I have, that. Look, where's my manipulation? There's no point in us aggravating each other. Let's both just go our separate ways. Don't move. We're not done yet. <laughs> You wanted to be the knight in shining armor and save the damsel in distress. Let's see how brave you are. <laughs> Someone threw you up bounds. The cost of effort points increases when using your skills. Use a golden elixir. Listen, we barely know each other, and it seems everything went a bit too far. Let me apologize if I offended you in any way. What's wrong? Someone cut your balls off? Oh uh, god damn it no, I was trying to get him to shoot me. You should have kept your big nose out. I was trying to get him to shoot me. Because it would have been kind of funny. Ah, <laughs> oh, god damn it. I forgot this is a game you can't go back and like rewind it. What? Oh god damn it. Okay. I blew everything. I thought I can't let go back. I was trying to do something fun. I can't rewind. I did not detain Lady Adams. I got knocked out. I didn't pick any of his, her talismans up. I could have found out something. I can't go back. I just... I broke up the, the little altercation and I was like, Please, I'm sorry! Oh my god. I was hoping I was gonna get shot right in the face. But why would that happen? The game needs to continue. There's no rewinding in this game, guys. It's like a telltale kind of game. I can't go back. I was trying to get something crazy to happen by... <laughs> oh, another nosebleed. But this time, it's not because I time-traveled. It's because somebody punched me. Actually, I did time-travel. dead to rights. You think about that. If you, get, if you get punched in the face and knocked out and you wake up 12 hours later, you time-traveled 12 hours ahead. So that is what I happened. I don't know what you were doing, but Elizabeth returned much too soon. Any earlier, and I would have been caught. I didn't get time to search through everything, but I did manage to find what I was looking for. The young lady really is John oh, Adams' it. daughter. Signed, George Washington. Well oh. done, Lee. Look at my the eye. President of the United States asked for your assistance and you screwed up? If mother finds out, I... I get the feeling I'll never hear the end of it. Not for a few years, anyway. Now, I hope it's like that for the rest of the game. What was I going to do last night? Right, can I get punched in the other side of my ah, face? Ah, yes. Search the room. According to what I saw in my vision, this room was Mother's before I got it. Maybe she left something behind that will help me find her. Right, next reading. All right, hold on. My, my, my internet's, like, taking a shit on itself right now. Is this, like, hold on. Let me just make sure. I don't know what it is with Twitch's East Coast servers for me right now. Everyone I try just gets fucked up. Just give me a second. I'm trying to see if this is a problem with me. It actually might be. I <laughs> thought it was just a bunch of jump cuts. Uh, I can't even... Open up a web page right now. Oh, why does everything suck around here? I told you I'm moving to Arizona. I'm getting I'm getting on a plane. I'm going to Arizona. No, I'm moving to La I'm gonna move to like Las Vegas, like I told you before. The power the shit never turns off in fucking Las Vegas. I'm gonna live somewhere in the middle of Las Vegas. No, my internet is is absolutely shit in the bed right now. We were talking about like a full on diarrhea. All right, it's probably gonna be all right here in a minute. Oh well. New Vegas playthrough. Yeah, this, this shit's getting real old, though, I'll tell you. Uh, I gave I got this book.
Do I have any uh, skill points here? Do I? Level two. Cultism. No, I don't have any points. Talents. Let's see. You gain one skill point in agility. So I, could, I got punched in the face and I got better at fighting. You gain one skill point in etiquette. Okay, cool. All right, let's go. Look for clues in your mother. Anybody think anybody burns up? Incredulity of Saint Thomas. Why is Caravaggio representing Saint Thomas? Writing his material. Should I write a letter? Uh, I don't have vigilance. Unfortunately. What about here? Bread. Go back to sleep. Nothing. I gotta start using these. I have the damn things. Drink the ink. For what? What is that gonna do for me? This room looks unoccupied. Is that a plant? Here's something will undermine my botanist appreciation for the local climate. Examine the bush. No vigilance. I need vigilance. I'm so useless. All I can do is lie to people. I can't do anything else. A priest's robe, crosses. Must be Piaggi's room. Eat the lemon. I, I would. I would. Oh, it's got books. Look, markings on the floor. Uh, just a bit worn out. I was hoping to find something leading to a secret path. Oh. This bookcase is well stocked. Hmm. Oh, this book has been put back the wrong way round. Yeah, lying and stealing. There we go. Found it. My intuitions. A voyage around the world. The travel log of the explorer. Dropping Leon big Clondon frames. Ugandan. Yeah, I I gotta figure out a solution here. This, this books. cannot continue. What a coincidence. I really do feel like that and there's internet problems or like it's just too connecting much. problems for me in this stream. I don't know what's going on like, here. At least once a week. If you felt threatened. This shit's got to stop. A clue, I got to figure out. I, I, I might have to move. I'm really probably going to have to move. Because I can't fix it. Faint sign this has been going on for like over a year. Visible. And I've had like technical people come Mother, up like a dozen fucking times. Undoubtedly it doesn't matter. Hidden a clue in this book. I'm Let's probably going to have to move. Anything else in this room. Real talk. Come on, Louis, think. Think. Let's recap. Move to Alaska. My mother was in this room. I found a rare edition of Move to Disneyland. Book. She must have left something behind. She must have used the writing materials. What if she used lemon juice instead? <laughs> Go to An Lego old trick Land. used to hide messages. It also affects the VODs. The yeah, well that's because the frame ink. data is not the being processed. Message. It's just skipping them. Now, how do I reveal the message? It is a absolutely monumentally infuriating issue. That, and it just, it, I don't know what it is, but it's something to do with this, like, shitty area. And I probably can't live here anymore. Inferno by Dante. Oh. Time to move to Candyland. All ye who enter here. Steal the book. My, all I can take is books. That's fucking dumb. The message is illegible. I have to keep searching. <sighs> Look. Markings on the floor. You never get slow. You never get snow out. in Phoenix. I was hoping to find something leading to a secret passage. It is a secret passage. Ooh, wait a minute. Access. Assess the value of the ash. Apart from getting the book dirty, I can't see any use for this. What the fuck? I just. <laughs> who cares about the value of the ash? There was no reason for me to do I just expended all my energy to find out how much money it was worth. What else you got here? The box? I got the key, right? There's a circle around the lock here. Must be the trunk Mortimer was talking about. The key should open it. Unlock. God damn it. No, just use the key! What do you mean? <laughs> 
Why would I pick the lock? Oh, this looks really hard to do. Hmm, I might as well, I got the key, but put that down. Let's do some extra effort here. Honey There's and a, a honey pot. A fax of Sœur de Richie to be given to her son, Louis. I should probably take it. Amber fragments. You just found an amber fragment. Each time you pick up four of them, you increase your maximum effort by one. Interesting. Okay. Saint Jerome and the Angel. Yet again, art with political undertones of an image of a saint here. Right, so, if I just spray the ashes all over the book, right? Just dump the ashes all over it. Spread ashes on the book. Damn, I'm making a serious mess here. It's no good. It might have worked if the writing had left marks in the paper, but no, there's only traces of lemon. Luckily, I've only put ashes on the of the message. Traces of lemon. I need the lemon. Can I rub ash all over the Look, floor? Markings on the floor. Eh, just a bit worn out. I was hoping to find something leading to a secret path. How do I get the lemons? I need to pick up the lemons. Inferno by Dante. Abandon hope, all ye who enter here. Alright, I'm unlocked. Just give me some Lovely more honey. Lectures, Open it with your hands. Yes, golden and very jolly. Is there an elixir in there? That's it? Oh, uh, that was the assessment of the ash. Assess the value of the candlestick. Um, no, I'm going to take the candle. Okay, we got candle, we got ashes. So I'm going to burn the book now, right? Take the ink. That's good. We got ink. What else is over here? A uh, big trunk. Yeah, Monsieur de Richer. No, I want to open the trunk. I haven't even had time to unpack my cases. No, that's mine. All right, what, what can we do now? Burn the book. <laughs> Light the book on fire. Uh, burnish the page with the candlestick. Pour some ink. Well... So it wasn't that, and I've just stained half the page. <laughs> just ruining it's always used to write a message, never to reveal one. I must find something else. Uh, ah, burn. it's working. Burn the book. The heat reveals the message. Let's see what my mother wrote. <laughs> Where all eyes size you up, you must pass by the Got Gorgon. It. Gorgon was the name of Medusa in Greek mythology. On the other hand. <laughs> Where all eyes size you up, it's like all I don't get it. And judging by the number of paintings in the manor, it could be anywhere. I have to go search all the Damn. paintings. The message continues, but thanks to me, the rest of the text is unreadable. Fuck. Great. I hope it wasn't a unique edition or mother's gonna kill me. Now I better hurry and find that damn Medusa. I gotta find the Medusa painting. Sir? Dinner is served. See, here we go, here we go. Settle. Dinner. Time for dinner. Typical. I'm not hungry. Please give my apologies to all the guests. No, I want to go. I want to uh, go eat. Sir Holm requests your presence, sir. Well, I guess I'm just going to have to wait before going and looking for my Medusa. No. Tell him I'll be there in a minute. Don't. Why? It's time for dinner. Dinner already? Yeah, we're gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna steal the Declaration of Independence. But yeah, I'm sorry that the every so often here the frames are skipping. I have exacerbated all options. So, this, this just happens sometimes. Sometimes just the internet just decides to just go to like 8% of what I pay for. I may have to take a little tour through like the rooms once a week. of the other guests. Yeah, like once once every one stream a week, we have to deal with like ten percent of my upload and download. It's really annoying. Just get right down there, to the first floor. Did I run all the way by? I'm not sure. That's the door to Elizabeth's room. Why am I going in?
Oh, that's the door to her room. Instantly enter it. For God's sakes, what happened in here? What? Somebody drawing a pentagram on the ground? Okay. Uh, hold on, I got, let me, let me, I, got, I got like a status effect problem, right? I gotta drink one of these. Okay, I'm good. Let's drink some honey. Uh, all right, someone's doing a someone's doing like a seance in here. Carmelite water. Bunch of free shit. They say that if you drink this, it gives you a real boost. A novel of the initiation of a young woman into a polite August twenty fourth, August seventeen ninety two. Elizabeth, I am driven to despair and doubt there is any point in writing to you. I'm not even sure <laughs> you're Satan, Satan Washington. Matters. Father controls my correspondence more and more. I am certain he filters our exchanges. Thankfully, one of the chambermaids is able to help me get my letters to you. But ah, whatever. June 11, gives a shit. 1791. My dear Elizabeth, your last letter gave me much cause for concern. Your words were so cold. As if emotions no longer matter to Who cares? Oh, good time to read poetry. Uh, what do we got? Investigate the drawer. Investigate the drawer. Looks like I found a box containing crystals. Some kind of white crystals. Well, why would I eat them immediately? Taste like? <laughs> I don't know why I just did that. Uh, I really need to stop tasting everything I find now. <laughs> Well, see what it tastes like. Ugh. I really need to stop <laughs> tasting everything I find now. Well, see what it tastes like. Ugh. I really need to stop tasting everything I find now. <laughs> well, see what it tastes like. <laughs> I'm gonna die. I really need to stop tasting everything I find now. Well, see what it tastes like. Ugh. What happens if I do this to I really need to stop tasting everything I find now. I can just drink one of those things and I'll be fine. Ugh. <laughs> sounds like Garfield. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> well, see what it tastes like. Ugh. We're this far deep, I need to know. I really need to stop tasting everything I find now. Well, see what it tastes like. What happens like. if I have zero? Ugh. With this far. I really need to stop tasting everything I find now. Times seven? Okay, what happens if you do times eight? Well, see what it tastes like. Ugh. I really need to stop tasting everything I find now. Times seven. Yeah, times seven is the most you can do. Okay. So, it's alright. I have zero action points. No, oh, I needed that. I needed that. I needed to laugh like that, man. God just keeps eating rocks pattern. No oh, shit, I can't unlock this. <laughs> Wait, what is the thing? It's right here. See? What? What are you talking about? Oh, it, it okay, okay, okay. It consumed everything. I get you. All right, we're good. Chest with a Eat half circle chest. pattern. Unlock it. I can do it. Yeah, all you need to do is just tap it in the right spot and get some free milk. Uh, uh, two more of those. An untutored hand copied these notes. Looks like a healing method. 
Well, that's a pity. Golden elixir. The writing is barely legible. Analyze the notes. Uh, analyze the notes with occultism or with science? With occultism. Feet and hands are bound. A piece of cloth in the mouth prevents the tongue from being sectioned. This is healing, It I looks guess. like preparation for an exorcism. Is Elizabeth really possessed? Okay, so Elizabeth Adams is, is Satan. I, somebody said it sounds like Garfield, and I can't fucking stop thinking about dear that. Dear Elizabeth, I'm writing to inform... Scratches on the mirror. Alright, I think we pretty much see everything we can see here. There's an exorcism in bed. Uh-huh, wait, we got more stuff here. Five circle-shaped key. August 24th. What about that one? 30th of November. Yeah. Alright, I just got the key. I didn't even need to use that. Hey, okay, let's go to dinner. That's good, right? Anything else? There's a big that's a big dog collar. Got a big dog. Looks like I found a box containing some kind of white crystals. These are magnesium crystals. I want to know a fairly they effective remedy for easing anxiety. Okay, I just got we got a we got a complete vulnerability now. All right, we got we're good. Let me look at that though. I want I'm curious. Journal. Here we go. Elizabeth Adams. Vulnerability questioning. She's immune to manipulation, and she's vulnerable to being questioned. So you better hope the dinner is crystals. Oh, my internet is so bad. It's causing me anxiety. I need to eat one of those crystals. All right, go down to the first floor. Get down there. What? I can't go there. All right, pair, can't, can't go that way. Hmm, I wonder what it tastes like. <laughs> oh, Odie. I wonder what that tastes like. Lasagna. Maybe. I hope you leave room for more crystals. Why can I go down the- right, I don't want to go down those stairs. I want to go down the other stairs. All right, what's for dinner? Ah, she doesn't like to be questioned. We got the same eye. Excuse me, Monsieur de Richet. I really need to talk to you. Is this about last night? No, that was just a misunderstanding. I'm sure it was a little bit my fault, too. We There's no the excuse same... for that man's horrible I... behavior. You ought to tell Sir Holmes. Look, the only thing that I care about is that I've lost something precious. I'm not worried about Jack Peru. You're her son. Sarah What's the finger? What was that? What was that E.T. finger? Yes. Why? Last night, I found out that your mother was on the island. What are you doing here? You don't like to be questioned. Excuse me, but speaking frankly, why would you care? I know your mother very well. Really? Yes. I have been in your mother's care ever since I was born. She nursed you. Oh, I wouldn't say nursed. No, I remember her stare. Why is everybody so injured? Ice. Her sadistic hands. <laughs> the guy pissing in the corner. What was that? Some drunk guy was just peeing in the corner. Too. She held let's go back. Let's go back that way. I want to see that again. Burned scars into me. Hold on a minute. What do you mean? Who you was that? Ask her when you see her. Huh? She's getting more and more agitated. Look, what? I've I've got to go. Wait. What opportunity missed? I need to know more about you and my mother. Why did she put you through all of that? Yeah, we go. Okay, here we go. There must be some reason for what she did. What's the point of rubbing salt in the wounds? I can't do any of these things. Uh I want to find out what really happened. 
No, you really don't want to know what your mother did when I shed my first blood at puberty. On the contrary, you can tell me anything. Let me be my own judge. Succeeded. You know your little game. You're no different from the rest of them. You couldn't give a damn about me. The only thing you're interested in is finding out about your mother. I didn't fail it. Don't say that. Not, not everyone wants to use you. Some people care about you, don't they? Mention her mother, mention her sister, mention her brother, mention her father. Um, no, sisters don't care. The sisters don't get along. The brothers, she, she's definitely like more interesting than her brother. Not sure about her father. What about her mother? No, mention her, mention her, well, mention your her mother. mother. For example. You mean the woman who left me in the hands of your mother? See, yes. The woman whose duty it was to give up her life to protect me? I disowned my mother when I turned 13. Uh, I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have mentioned her. Sister. Haven't you got a sister? Yes. <laughs> I'm sure she loves you with all her heart. Yes, you got it right. She's the only one who cares about me. I would have put an end to it all by now if it weren't for her. Since you insist, I'll tell you how I met your mother. Thanks for trusting me. You see, before I was born, it was in the letter. Well, I was reading that letter. Hallucinations and fits of anger. Soon, people could barely recognize her. She became a completely different person. So my father spent an enormous amount of money paying for the best doctors, but none of them were able to cure her. The last resort was to call a priest. Call the call the police. So, is that what your father did? Call the police. No. He went to an expert in the occult. Uh -oh. Ah, my mother. Her reputation already extended beyond our borders. My mother's fits stopped at my birth, and Sarah de Richet concluded that the evil had passed into me. Not only did it encourage her to stay, but she took the opportunity to advise my father to separate me from the rest of my family. Damn. That's how I was declared stillborn. My fate was decided that very day. This is all real. It would coincide with my mother's frequent trips to America. I had my first fit when I was three. That's when your mother began her experiments to rid me of the evil inside. The evil within? I understand how you feel, but I know my mother. I'm sure she had her reasons, even if it seems difficult to believe. Everything she put me through was all for nothing. My whole life was ruined for nothing. So what brings you here then? My father used to know like Wolverine's son would look like. He offered to introduce me to the world's in leading a Marvel authority Universe in the future occult. comic Lord Mortimer. He was my last hope until I found out yeah. he had also invited His your son mother. Rogan. It's got to be a coincidence. I don't believe for a second she's come here for you. You can't change my mind about this, Louis. My days are numbered, and I know it. Okay, it's time for dinner. Got a new character to introduce here. I've noticed you two have the same eye condition. Should we start taking conjunctivitis medication? I can't save. There he is. There's me. What can I do for you, sir? I am at your service day and night, sir. Uh. Help me. As I was unable to bring my personal effects with me, I was wondering if you could find me a few items. <laughs> of I hope course, I can get beat up again. What would you be require? Mess. Do you have any golden elixir? Do you have any Carmelite Whopper? Do you have any manuscripts? Have you got any amber? Would you like to... Do you have any... Would you have any Devil's Thorn? Why is this guy a drug dealer? Alright, well, do you got... Do you have any... Do you have any amber? My good fellow, would you have any amber available? I would, but unfortunately, I don't think I am authorized to give it out. This guy's so easy to manipulate. I we'll believe it. it is a precious stone. Watch this. I'll, pay a, I'll play a trick on him and steal from him. No point in lying, you know. I know full well you haven't got any. I would never think of lying, sir. I don't believe I am authorized to give it away. That okay, is all. Okay, so how am I going to get Amber? it? Amber? Here? I'd be surprised. Yet, I Where am I going to get it from? You, sir? No, you're pulling my leg. I don't believe you. 
I wouldn't dare to joke with, sir. Yeah, Pro like, is this sure. a prove it situation? You're just me on. I dare, I you, to show dare you to show it to me. You really have some. I'm going to snatch well, it from his then, hand. Sir, here is a piece. Ah, oh, right. Well, I'm impressed. Can you lend it to me for a minute? Of course, sir. Here. Wow. I can hardly believe it. Well, I have other questions. <laughs> of course, sir. But, sir, I believe you haven't given me back the amber, sir. What? This guy what is an amber? idiot. The piece I gave to sir. No, I don't know what you're talking about. You really ought to look after your things. It can't be easy to come across amber in these parts. Ah. Um, well, does sir This is the worst servant else? ever. No fucking way are you this dumb. Right, well, do you have any of this? I still haven't quite recovered after the boat You crossing. forgot that you just gave it to me? Would you have any Maltese cross by any chance, please? I, I am sorry, sir, but the Maltese cross may be just a plant, but it is also a powerful psychotropic drug that causes undesirable diuretic effects. Mm -hmm. I would advise against, sir, taking any. Am I going to do this pull the same trick? Oh, that's too bad. I don't want to, no, that's not worth it. What about a uh, golden elixir? You wouldn't have a little golden elixir I could use, would you? Oh, unfortunately, sir, I have orders go. not to give any of that medicine to any of Lord Mortimer's guests. Some guests are here to follow a very strict treatment. Mixing or combining certain substances would be dangerous. He has no sir. air holes at the side of his face. It is not for consumption. No, I don't want to waste that much. A little Carmelite water would do me a lot of good. Could you find me some, please? Oh, the tonics are under lock and key, sir. Lord Mortimer only allows access to them in cases of emergency. Yeah, really? You sure you have any? <laughs> what a lie. No. No, all right. What about manuscript? What's that book you're hiding in your jacket? The Sorrows of Young Werther by Goethe. Imagine sir. doing this and inside I am of that not hiding it. <laughs> me, please. It is damaged, sir. <laughs> would be a disaster. I would never dare lend, sir, a book. That would take about ten minutes to clean state, that in the, in the sink. I took it to restore. Oh, you took it? Oh, well, that's my book. Hang on, but it's mine. Beg pardon, sir. It's my book. I'm telling you, it's my book. <laughs> With all due respect, sir, I hope, sir, will understand that I have doubts. You see, I found it in Lord Mortimer's library. <laughs> There you are, then. That's exactly where I left it. I oh, am shit. I'm such a bad person. Sir. I don't know what to say. In that case, I suggest you say nothing and hand it over. But I... Now. But, sir, I... Very well, sir. Now. Very well. May, sir, take good care of it. It is damaged. And you've damaged it as well? Well, bravo. Oh, I think I deserve a, a, a elixir no, for that no, one. I didn't do anything. It wasn't me, sir. Give me some money. Say pardon. Pardon me, sir. Very good. There were some other things I wanted to go over with you. All right, well, we got the sorrows of young Wartha. Okay, we're good. Well, I, I feel like, like I can get speak about everything master, out of this guy. Lord Mortimer. Do please excuse me, sir, but I shall make no comment about my master. Guarantee we get it Is right there here. anything else that sir would like to know? Uh, okay, well, he won't do it. All right, I got dinner to eat. It was like the GTA backwards punch huge haymaker into his head. And then it says mission failed. Alright, let's, uh, anything else we can do here? Don't believe so. <laughs> I still got my ass kicked and I'm, I'm attracting like this. Why didn't I act like this earlier? Here we go. What do you want? What's up, buddy? If you touch Elizabeth again, I promise, when you get back to Paris, your head will end up on a spike. I Please couldn't punch him. stop. You're scaring me. I'm a member of the tribunal. You shouldn't threaten me like that. I wish I could punch him. You should have done agility. Golden order. With all the contacts in the Paris press, that implies. One word for me, and you'll be headline news. A full page dedicated to your little stay here. 
So what? Wipe your ass with it. Your revolutionary friends are sure to be delighted reading about your new friendships with all these Hit rich the nobles side. on the island. The thought of you here, Punch me in the laughing inside of my face, please. Luxury, I'm sure they'll congratulate you for profiting from your position. I'll be blind. <laughs> I forbid you to blackmail You're me. You're in no position to forbid me from anything. So you'd better remember what I said. <laughs> Devil pink eye detective, come on. Oh. Ah! I talk like this, that means I'm automatically a bad guy. Dear friends, I bid you welcome. See? I hope the night was not too short. Your eminence, Duchess, Monsieur de Richet. Allow me to introduce our new guests. They arrived during the night. Johann Christoph von Wollner, Minister of Religious Affairs and close aide of will Frederick that. William II, King of Prussia. Napoleon Bonaparte, Lieutenant of the French Revolutionary Army. And Jacques Peru, French Revolutionary Tribunal Judge. Unfortunately, my friends, Lord Mortimer will not be joining us this morning, but he should be with us later. So, the let eccentric us begin. billionaire does not what he's gonna is show up playing it. He tells me to come urgently and he sends no one to meet me. Ah. He's gonna be the servant. And it's uh, you it, thank you again for the vine, your eminence. I don't have any, I, I miss every all these opportunities. The king's table. I am delighted to hear it. Volner and Piaggi oh. seem to be getting along well, my friend. God damn it! <sighs> My dear Johan, how are you? I was gonna go for his land cross. And yourself? Very well. And your husband? He's poorly. The French. This fucking Elvira looking girl is Dawes talking. I, that, that's gonna be an extra second there. I you have to have one or two extra seconds. Situation is settled. If by chance the French crisis is emulated in Berlin, there will always be a refuge for you in London, my dear. Your offer does you honor, Emily. But London is much closer to Paris than Berlin. Beware. The French are capable of sailing... So we're going to talk about how this guy looks like a magician from what? Can I look at his tie and be like, oh, so you're a magician? I'm shaking in my clogs. <laughs> <laughs> Is the wine to your life? Wait, for what? Very much so, Sir Gregory. Such complexity. Opportunity <laughs> missed. A sort down, isn't it? I don't understand. Absolutely. If I'm not mistaken, this is not Lord Mortimer's favorite wine. It is yours. In his absence, I have taken the liberty of making a slight right. deviation Let's start from food the fight. But I count on your discretion. <laughs> don't worry, that I appreciate please. the same grape varieties as you. I remember the last time we I tasted I that nectar it. here at this table. The finest minds of the century were present. And the last time we drank, what are we eating? the orphanage in Bloomsbury was still in ruins. Somebody ate a bunch of hot dogs or something and threw them up into a plate. Oh, well, uh, I put some small effort into the works. The orphanage reopened just before Christmas. That's a chili. We're, we're having like a Texas chili right now that somebody regurgitated. I... I don't know what to say. You have given the girls a wonderful Christmas gift. Thank you. This is Christmas? I made a promise. Now it is done. Got her. It's the first time I've ever seen her so moved. Just mention that orphanage broke right through Emily's hard shell. How is that an opportunity? <laughs> is everything all right? I know everything about yes, this girl. Thank you. I had a moment of absence, but here I am again. Let's get, let's get some washing. Many believe he is the real leader of Prussia. A charming man, but with an iron fist and a velvet glove. Everyone always talks about he's George Washington being this kind of guy. In all his forms. He's always got this voice. Like, no, I'm George Washington. He's so, listen to this gritty, gruffy man. What if he talked like this? This was his real voice? Napoleon. Nobody knows. It's not recorded. I hope he sounded like this. Where's the tape recording? Uh. <laughs> what do you think, madam? What is this bonus? Somebody needs to put here? George Washington in the game never a or in a movie, and I'll, let me do that. I'll voice him. going to be further war. To answer your question, I only know that his family were in favor of the revolution, and that it Kermit? cost them. That's not Kermit. Lives. Thank you. That's Kermit's way lower than that. 
Monsieur de Richer? Yes. It would seem we have common interests. Could we speak in private, please? <laughs> this is, I thought Napoleon was supposed to be like three feet tall. Napoleon was like three feet tall. This is bullshit. Let's look it up. How tall was Lord Napoleon? And the Golden Order, through your mother, have concluded a financial agreement. No, he was five seven. He was as tall as I am. Listening. An agreement for Canada. <laughs> Lord Mortimer assured me that you are to take We're the exact the same height. I'm a little bit taller than him, though. Maybe by his hair. You must know that I am deeply sorry about our disappearance, but I must validate the deal urgently if I want to be able to organize things properly. I haven't seen Lord Mortimer yet. I'm afraid I'll be unable to answer your questions. He assured me that you could replace your mother during her absence. You know how how much I of a terrifying but still, leader he was? This is a bit hasty. He was 5'7", and he was continue. one of the most diabolical, <laughs> dangerous men in but all of I Europe. I need to know if I can count you among my allies. Well, of course. And for that, I have a little question and for you. I just like, I throw him over the edge. stipulates an aid of 50,000 louis d'or for 200 cannons. What? I cannot. Uh, wait a minute. Hold on. Uh, that's the butterfly from Life is Strange. We have to make a good decision here. Yeah, sure. I'll, I'll get fucking live. Who cares? Absolutely. Fifty thousand Louis d'Or in hard cash. The offer I'm talking about was for only twenty thousand Louis d'Or, Monsieur de Richer. No. Oh. The truth is, you really have no idea about our agreement. So you're wasting my time. I need to work with people I can have confidence in, sir. The exact numbers may have escaped me. I suggest you wait for my mother's return in order to manage such details. They may details. have escaped me. I have one last question I would like to pose to you. Did he have hair like this? We don't know Did each he? other yet, you and I. And I need to make sure that we both share the same vision for the future of France. Okay. Given the hard times that have befallen our beautiful country, what do you think it would take to restore its uh, luster? Oh, shit. There we go. Just manipulate. I think what France is lacking today is a truly strong leader ready to govern her. Someone who will restore her luster, who will propel her forward so once again she becomes a proud nation respected by all. A man capable of both rebuilding the country from the inside and talking about you developing exterior relations. Someone with a vision, I think. The right person still remains to be found. You're right, my friend. I hear your words, and I agree. Monsieur de Richer, I am reassured. I am very happy to have you. <laughs> I need a tissue. Some... Lord Mortimer Fuck. was right Somebody to put his trust in you. I <laughs> hope to work with oh. you in the very near future. I would like to thank you for your support Fuck. by offering you this humble little gift. Ooh. Hmm. Reflections on the revolution in France. Mr. Bonaparte, yeah, Mr. I thank you for this Mr. Bonaparte, gesture. Please know leader of France, is one of the most easily you. manipulatable people ever. Fuck up and lie, get caught in a lie, and then say like that you would be a great leader. We need a good leader, and now he trusts me. I would like to thank Lord Mortimer and you, sir. When does the murder happen? For bringing us all together here. Those of us for whom it is not the first time here, like me, are all trembling in sweet anticipation of the arrival of our host. For the all rest, right. I would like to reassure you that Lord Mortimer always has a few surprising projects to propose. <laughs> but I can <laughs> assure you, would you that rather? each and every one of us has always benefited from them. <laughs> would you rather? The last time I came to this place, Lord Mortimer offered to help me in my electoral campaign for the presidency of the United States. I really was hoping he was going to have a and it is fucked up right uh, clear left that eye. his support was an invaluable aid to us. We are here among <laughs> like-minded people. So let us put aside another butterfly the behind him in which some of our nations find themselves at present. So, I another raise butterfly. My oh, that's definitely Chloe. In honor of you all, my new and old friends. <laughs> Sorry. I trust you shall not be disappointed, Mr. Washington. Right. We shall meet again tomorrow. All the guests will be present, as well as no. Lord Mortimer. No, we don't get anything done. Until Come then, on. I trust you will find plenty to keep you amused.
but I dirtied one part. That's all? That's it? I succeeded in everything except I dirtied something? I'm all right with that. It's like a little kid telling somebody that he did something wrong. I did this, and then I did this, and I did this, but I dirtied one part, but it was okay. All right, we got how many points? Eight points. Holy shit. Let's do, we got level two. That's a lot. Uh, we need to do agility. Use a coordination against your surroundings and sometimes against people. I want to be able to, to throw punches and shit. Logic. Psychology is uh, already there. Should I get this leveled up to like level 2? Cultism. No. Science. Conviction. Convince people with the sheer force of your will and your attitude. Vigilance, yeah. Let's get that to level 1. Questioning. Notice anything strange in someone's behavior or appearance. Alright, that's good. And we'll do one. We'll get a cult to level two. I'm liking that. Ah, uh, we don't have any. Ed, ed, we get, we questioning is fine. I want to be able to punch people now. We'll get politics up there later. George Washington already likes us. It doesn't matter. We're good. By the way, the second I'm able to throw a punch at somebody, I'm going to do so immediately. Regardless of the consequences. Alright, let's recap. Before dinner, I was going to investigate my mother's message. Let's recap. I gotta find the place where all eyes size you up. I get some new books here. I need all the pages of this one. We got Thoughts of the French Revolution. One skill in politics. The Sorrows of Young Werther, which is one skill in psychology. Skill in etiquette. Mm, either let's see what is this politics I'll do politics I can only do one book right yeah find the place mentioned by your mother okay real question am I enjoying the game uh, I don't know I don't know yet Maybe. It depends on what happens in the next few minutes. Well, your eminence, do you still have any room left? Ah, uh, my son, the scene of gluttony is the most There's only one episode out right now, yeah. Eyes. It's probably over in about 40 minutes. What a charming moment we have had together. It, lo it looks I'm like... I'm delighted I was able to talk know. to Mr. Von Waldner. We hadn't spoken to each other for an eternity. Yes. I noticed that your eminence Maybe. knew a fair number of people at the table. The if somebody dies, we'll see. My son. If there's a big whoa shit moment in the end of this episode to get to grab us so we come back for the second episode, then maybe. It's the perfect place to make new friends. Indeed, I noticed that you and Mr. Bonaparte had already begun. Ah, I adapt quickly to local customs. It's what I was taught. <laughs> and you are right to do so, my I'm only here to see the George then, Washington have romance. Have you had any news of your mother since your arrival? <sighs> Alas, still nothing, your minutes. But... I still haven't been able to meet Lord Mortimer. Do not worry. It I just is want to drop a bowling ball on my what head. What can I say? Bump. Lord Mortimer is a very busy man. I should think you are beginning to worry. Remember how much we argued before the stream? <laughs> well, I, I must admit, Your Eminence, indeed it does worry me. I understand. But continue to have faith in Santa. You'll see, I'm sure, that in a few days we'll all be laughing together. That's What's my favorite Shakespeare play. For, um, but, well, I have you with me. I, I have a question for you. Um, Go ahead, what can the I Tempest. Do for you? Why, why are all of our eyes all fucked up? As I haven't visited all the manor yet, I wondered if you hadn't seen a Medusa by any chance. I beg your pardon. Yes, La La Gorgogne, the Medusa from Greek mythology. Would you have seen one in any shape or form? Not at hmm. all, my son. I'm not sure Why what you so you're getting at, but unfortunately, I, I'm not going to be of any use. <laughs> Was I a theater kid? Anyway, your minutes. I 
won't take up any more of your time. On that well, last a word, theater then, kid. I shall leave you to fight your demons. See you later, your eminence. See you later, my son. Well, didn't get anything out of that. If I, I swear to God, if there's a Medusa painting right here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go punch that guy in the face. Oh, that's a couple of peaches. Pigs. Uh. I don't know. Oh, that's down. Wait, is this Medusa? Medusa. Circe preparing wine. No, it's Circe. What better trap for Ulysses? Discourse on the map. Book by Descartes. Medusa. So which one is Medusa? Was a world. snake, not a pig, right? Medusa. Yep, there it is. The conversion of Ulysses by Gours. <laughs> Circe changing Ulysses' companions into swans. I have no idea. Can I find somebody? Where's the servant? Can I convince the servant to tell me where everything is? That's Zeus. The only person sizing me up here is that monumental Zeus. It can't what be this here. One? Nope. <laughs> I'm just gonna go look at paintings for an hour. Oh hey, there he is. What Excuse can me. I do for you, sir? Um, I am at your service, day and night, sir. What can I find on the ground? Where, where's Medusa? No, this guy's useless. We might have to go ask people. Go up to people's rooms and find out whether who they are. Question. Would George Washington know about that? No. I don't think so. No. Well, it's worth a shot to go find somebody's room to open. Nope, can't go that way. Hey, these look like pages taken from an ancient encyclopedia. Encyclopedia? Wait a minute. Oh, I don't know what the hell. <laughs> There's three people that still have not been seen yet. George fucking Washington. There's five circles on this chest. That's a lot. I found the entire stash. It's only one? No, there's like it was like five in there, four in there at least. There we go. Nice. Great. Nice. Mm. Sir, I don't know where they are, sir. I'm not allowed to give them to guests. Let's take them. Well, um, I would like to go upstairs, but I can't. So, I'm assuming I have to talk to somebody else. I can't go outside. No. So, talk to the priest again? These are blocked off. Is anybody else in here? Did we miss somebody else, like, sitting down? Butterflies everywhere. Now we gotta get the right dialogue option with him, I think. Maybe. Let's try it again, can we? No. God damn it. Amber, you collected four amber. Now your maximum effort is increased. Amber crystals. Sweet. Alright, can somebody get, like, hit by a bus or something? <laughs> we gotta, we gotta, we gotta get something to happen. Alright, this is, this is something happening here. This is a new area. Honey, I couldn't have hoped for better. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> People have to make Jupiters in the chat. Bring back Beanbag Sonic. We're almost done with this. We've got, we're this far, we can't just stop. We're good. We're a solid maybe 30 to 40 minutes away from beating the first episode. We have to get to the, the big shocker, you know? We have to get to, we at least have to get to the part where George Washington flashes us. Where all right? eyes size you up. I found it. Chances are, that's the room my mother spoke of. And she also spoke of a Medusa. Should I go and try to find the creature now? Uh, yeah. Why is he saying Medusa? Oh, she also spoke of Medusa. Celia. The name means nothing to me. The Last Supper by Leonardo da Vinci. Mm -hmm, take Carmelite it. Water. Take it. Would I not be able to take this if I didn't have thievery as a skill? A meeting between Louis XIV and Philippe Sank. I wonder why Mortimer's particularly fond of this painting. The company Just check by everything. Rembrandt. Amber Crystal. <laughs> Rembrandt! I have this one. This is up in my uh upstairs. It was it's a pretty large painting. It was like 40, 50 million dollars. I took out a loan the to get it. Fall of Phaeton. Another painting by Rubens. Poor Phaeton. It's actually just like it's outside Lightning my house. Father Apollo for borrowing his chariot. The it's uh, on the side of my house. It's essentially like a giant mural on my house. Just hung up. Near. His brain is oozing by. Ah, François Premier receiving the Holy Family. Why is he talking with an accent like that? But he's not talking with an accent when he speaks normally. What the hell? Oh. No reason to sit down. <laughs> it's behind the blockbuster certificate. Uh, here he is. A painting with no name. Is that the guy? Every every big bad guy in every video game has a giant painting of themselves in their study. It has to be the bad guy. Oh, uh, that's not Medusa. There's Medusa. No, that's who's that? I don't know who that is. I don't know who these guys are either. What's that? Reach. Honey, I couldn't have hoped for better. What's this? I don't know. Oh, there's a. Uh... What's his name there? The guy, the God of War. Ares. There's Ares. Found it! Find out what mother was trying to do with her. The Medusa. A hero armed with a sword. Hmm. A hero with a lantern. And the last one holding a shield. <laughs> I'll stake my life on it. All the stuff we a flash. single scene together. The poor devils are about to face the beast. Doesn't it just seem like let's give them a help. It just looks like people with weird, odd sexual fancy. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that's just what I see. I know it's like art, I know it's old and shit, but like I keep thinking I'll keep it. It's like people like having fun with their like odd sexual fantasies. <laughs> now Louis, it's time to keep a logical mind as every good scientist should. The aim is to defeat the Medusa. So what can the lantern be for? Fifth grade. To light up the Medusa? Hardly likely. The hero holding the lantern will be easy prey, and the shield will be of no use. To light up the sword? No. That makes no sense. You gotta kill Medusa. So that leaves the shield. Hmm. I wonder if the aim is to play with the light. If I turn the shield right, the light would be reflected. The ray of light will perturb the Medusa and focus her attention on the best protected hero. Okay, so... Pretty smart. That, pretty smart. So we get the guy with the shield that needs to bounce the light into Medusa's face, and then guy with the sword has to kill Medusa. So rotate the statue uh, toward Medusa. Then you got a guy with the uh, guy with the shield aims the bounce the light. Guy with the lantern holds the light in the right direction. Uh, 
uh, toward the shield. And go bounce to the light. Guy with the shield, face it toward the Medusa. Right, there you go. Now towards the lantern. And then bounces. Wait, well, he already was, already was facing Medusa. Medusa's got to look towards the shield. Reflecting off the eyes. If I respect the legend, I have to place the hero holding the shield in front of the Medusa. That's what I did. Except for here, it doesn't work. There must be something else. What are you talking about? There must be something else. Hmm. A painting with no name. He just told me that that was correct. Doesn't understand reflections. So rotate the statue towards the towards the lantern. It looks right, but nothing's happening. Maybe in this position, the hero with the shield is just dazzling his colleague. The well, fuck. The fuck. <laughs> go, go back to the servant. So what? You have to move towards Medusa. No, you have to be like that. But you bounce it across. What if he doesn't understand light? I have to bounce the, the light off the shield. Which, which direction has he not looked? So what about towards... Hold on. No, I, I, I was under the impression... Alright, listen. I was under the impression the guy with the sword had to kill Medusa. Not bounce light off of his sword. Like, I was assuming the guy with the sword kills Medusa by stabbing her. Not, we all bounce light off of each other and- No, it just fucking- I, That's what I would have done. Rah, for Pete's I would have closed sake, my eyes and ran in with the sword. The Easiest off. thing you've ever done. Don't ever do that again. Oh no, Medusa, don't, don't look at her. Much Close much your eyes and run straight, hold the sword out like a lance and just stab about. anything in front of you. If, Stop you know, if somebody around. gets in front of you, you, you scream out, out loud as loud as you can. Everybody get out of the way, I'm gonna kill Medusa! And you just keep going forward, sprinting. If somebody doesn't listen to you, then they're gonna be in the way, and they're gonna get stabbed. <laughs> Rah! I was feeling a bit peckish. I went in search of the kitchen, and I ended up here. No oh my God! Somebody gave a hundred bucks. Mind-boggling, isn't it? Fred Flintstone, well, no, why are you giving a hundred dollars to say tee hee poo poo pee pee? Now, since you're here, make yourself useful. Look around on your side. I'll do the same on mine. And if you find anything of interest, let me know. Poo poo yeah. pee pee tee hee. Thank you so much, Fred. At your service, madam. Fred Flintstone. One hundred dollars. Thanks a lot, man. Huge money from our resident Stone Age friend. <laughs> but but your com your comment. <laughs> if that's what you got to say. Then thank you very much, man. Carry on searching. Carry on searching. All right. Um. But anyways, yeah. You know how I would beat Medusa? It'd be pretty easy. You got everyone talking about, oh, yeah, she's gonna sidestep you. Uh, it's called, I would put on a pair of reflective glasses with a polarized coating. So she's not actually looking at your eyes. Everyone, Medusa has to actually look into your eyes. If you're wearing glasses, sorry, she's not looking directly into your eyes. It's, she's looking at a lens. Not gonna work. Just have a prescription. You'll beat her. This is a uh, uh, Apocrates's helmet. Guess what I found? The Holy Grail. Older than that. A piece of Noah's Ark. Not that old. This could go on for hours. Just tell me. Caesar's laurel wreath. Stop! Don't put your <laughs> this is so disrespectful. Fingers on it. You find my fingers fat? 
<laughs> At least put on some gloves. No, Please the mirror is not going to work. Are slim. She'll close her eyes and run Denmark's. forward. My God, what an amateur. Saying, get out of the way, I'm going to kill this motherfucker. To have sexy fingers and everybody like that gets it her way, it's like, holy shit, get out of her way, she's going after this guy. Passes, so I can have your tutor executed. Let's compare hands then. We'll soon see whose fingers are fattest. <laughs> no, I'm not going to compare hands with you. Let's just keep going. Bad loser. What the fuck is that? Bad loser. Well, oh, looks like a oh. pamphlet on different political regimes. Written by Mortimer himself. Here's something interesting. A manor in Maine. Hundreds of acres of land in Catalonia. Yeah, New England. Properties in Shanghai. Incredible. Shanghai, Maine. Some of I these deeds place. are over 600 years old. And all signed by the hand of Mortimer. I wonder if that's what inspired my mother's attention. How come all these documents have Mortimer's signature on them? Do you think all these properties really belong to him? <laughs> hmm. Let's See those take fine it. scratches around the words? Yes, and why the is his face all bloody? Because I got the paper. I got punched in the face exactly an hour and a half ago, and I'm not the recovered. Signature. The deed was written using the same ink. If it is a fake, then it's a professional job. Maybe Mortimer is immortal or capable of living for a very long time. More like than one smile. Mortimer. That's what I'm thinking too. A first smile. Careful. Keep that up, and soon you'll end up laughing. Carry on sprouting inanities like that, and indeed I might. These documents are intriguing, but do you really think that's what attracted your mother's attention here? And how do you know my mother was interested in this room? I didn't know, I just supposed she was. And you just confirmed it. So? Alright, this is supposed to be a murder mission. Who gets murdered? I don't know. She was obsessed with Mortimer, and I must confess, these property deeds are troubling. If that's the case, why would she have left them? Once again, I don't know. We'll have to ask her when we find her. And what's your take? Why conceal? What do you think of the collection? How has it all been acquired? Why conceal? Why keep such a collection hidden in a secret room? A bad loser. Any thoughts? Mortimer has every reason in the world to conceal it. All right, don't worry. We're moving on to Burnout Paradise here in a second. Hey, no, we're, Emily, no, no, we're not. We're going to finish the episode. Thieves. We're only looking. I wonder why my mother didn't make it clear what she was interested in here. She didn't have time to write it down, or maybe she wasn't sure of what she was looking for. Gotta play the game in French. Or she wanted to protect her discoveries. It's disturbing. You'll just have to search the rest of the room. Maybe you'll find something. Ra. Well, maybe if you get out of the way. What, maybe if you, why did you, back in the day, why did the women wear these big bum devices? You know what I'm talking about? They wore these giant bird cages under their dresses. I can't even get by you now. All right, pick up that false amber crystals. Sword. You should see this sword, Emily. It's magnificent. I'm busy. Describe it to me. Um, um, sword of King Arthur, the sword of Genghis Khan. This weapon is typically French, quite old. Undoubtedly goes back to the Crusades. Do I not wear if it a bomb device? If it is sword, no. it's worth more than a kingdom. Um, we, I got. I want to just get this right. Cast quillens and knobs, a beautiful cruciform line. Judging by the wear and the technique used to forge it, this Genghis sword Khan's dates of back choice. to the Crusades, and it must have belonged to a wealthy knight. There's a date. N C X C. 1190. MCXC. That's right. Forge for the Crusades. For the Crusades. Genghis Khan. King Arthur. That's the sword of Joan of Arc. It really does look like Joan of Arc's sword. The famous maid of CB, Orion, BB. One of your favorite historical heroines. You bet. Given the number of English butts she kicked. And we all know where that got <laughs> Genghis her. Genghis Khan. When you finished playing, maybe yeah, remember when Genghis Khan was in the Crusades? The King Arthur was like the sixth century. What? What is that you found? A cameo pendant. Oh, I thought that was a piece of chocolate. What's I thought that was on? a Werther's original. Nothing. For crying out loud, Emily, you lunge for that jewel like your life depended on it. Tell me what this is about. No. 
We just met Louis. I like you, but I can't just suddenly open myself up like a book to you. Listen, Emily. It seems pretty obvious to me that you haven't come here for the sole purpose of sampling Mortimer's cellar. Stop all the clever evasions and just trust me. And why the hell should I place time. my trust in you, Louis? First, let me just drink some honey. Because clean up your own backyard first. Because you already did, because I trust you. Because I don't want a harm to come to you. Hmm. I'm not gonna... Because I trust you. I can't even use it. Alright. Clean up your own damn backyard. Nothing. I have done absolutely nothing for you. No to this, no to that. You ask for proof of trust, but when you get it, you turn a deaf ear. You are defiant, evasive, and paranoid. Go question your own motives. I've done all I can. All right, fine. There's no point getting on your okay. high horse, you know. So I'm wary. I grant you She's that. She's strong to logic. Well, the other one was three points, too. It doesn't matter. Fairly reliable. That's it? It's not. This is I not that in-depth. Well, I'm prepared to trust you when it comes to choosing She's strong to logic. She's weak to psychology. They were both three points and both got me a check mark. Nothing to gain? Damn it, Emily. I'm only trying to help you. Stop needing to gain something all the time. Because you think I need help. Just like everyone. You have your strengths and your weaknesses. And there's no use really? pretending otherwise. Ha. Huh. And I bet you found out where I'm weak, haven't you? A weakness in... Uh, weakness in... Wait, what was it? She's weak to... Journal. Yeah, I do know your weakness. Where are you? You are... You're vulnerable to psychology. Mm-hmm. You don't like being analyzed. At all. You think your scathing wit protects you, but in fact, it makes you blind. No sooner have people introduced themselves than you already see them in a bad light. You play the part of a strong woman, and yes, you are a strong woman, of course. But what I see yeah. is a sensitive young lady who lacks <laughs> self-confidence. Stop adopting a defensive posture, and you'll see just how quickly new doors will open. Mind. There is some truth to what you say. I might Did her hair get gray over the last couple of hours? I don't need your help to overcome them. And I'm simply not contemplating collaborating with anyone at this time. Do you understand? Uh, she likes to lead her investigation. She likes. She takes orders from someone. She already has a partner. Hmm. Uh, is an English duchess close to the English crown. Very discreet about her origin. I mean, we get to the place of the wedding. Let's see. Regular visit from Lemony accepted Sir Gregory Holmes' invitation to come to Lord Mortimer's Island because nothing in the world she missed one of those feigned receptions. <laughs> hmm. I think she already has somebody that she's working with. You already have a partner. Yes, it's perfectly clear. You're already working with Somebody's someone. Already, you're, you're working with the enemy. Well spotted, Louis. I already have a work partner. Super intelligence. I know Super intelligence. I don't doubt that your abilities will be of use to me, but I already have all that, thanks to my teammate. Is there any chance you might tell me who he is? I'll get it out. Mm, no, I've already said too much. Consider yourself lucky I've even given you this much. It's extremely rare, believe me. Come on, don't stop now that you've come mm. this far. You know that eventually I'll end up making you talk. Well, since no one can resist you, let's see if you can guess who my partner is. Let's see if we can do it. You're a gambler. So, your partner it's a is... It's a woman. You can't... Man, it's a woman. Hmm. I think it's... I think it's Washington. Mm-hmm. Let me, let me do a little bit of calculation here. She probably. They wanted. Remember them? Her in Washington. Remember her in what? Remember she wanted to stay behind with Washington? Hold on, let me, let me just get. Just wait a second. Super intelligence activated. Analyzing. It's a woman, and it's my mom. It's as obvious as it is surprising. You're my mother's hard hitting partner. Oh. God, do you really believe the nonsense that comes out of your mouth? Well, 
Oh, <laughs> wait, no, it was that was not right. A little. Sorry, Louis. Your mother is not my partner. It's Washington. Okay, it's Washington. Wait, could it be Washington? It might not be Washington. It might be somebody else. Let me just get my brain to work a little bit here. Just one sec. Uh, it's a man. Let me think here. I gotta get this right. Hmm. Analyzing today. I think. Completed. It's a man. It it it. A bit a bit. It is gonna be. It's her old husband. husband. Of course. My husband. He can't even walk without a cane. Fuck. Poor old man. Let him live out the rest of his days in peace. I gotta try this again. Turn it back on. Let me at, analyze again. <laughs> it's a woman, and it is gonna be. This is not computer sounds. This doesn't, I don't know. I need to be updated. This doesn't work. Uh, there's too much computer power. I think it's, uh, it's, I think it's your mother. You think I'm your mother. It must be your mother. I would need to know who she is then. Shit! Forgive me, I, I didn't know. I'm an orphan. I thought you'd figured that out. No, I, I didn't know. Otherwise, I wouldn't have mentioned it. Now you know. Last chance. <laughs> There's gotta be another one here somewhere, right? Okay, this is... Here we go. I have an ad. I mean, it's, it's very fitting. The first to finish gets complete control of the oasis. Okay, here we go. Let's turn. We got analyzing computer data. Last chance. Analyzing. I don't. What? <laughs> this is a dentist drill. Computer data analyzing. He's <laughs> getting teeth cleaned. <laughs> Using fluoride. Sister. Sister. She's your partner. She's the one you're looking for. Well, I am impressed. Got it. How the devil did you guess I had a sister? Virtually no one even knows. When it comes to getting results, you are very good. I grant you that. You deserve to know why the sight of the cameo pendant affected me so strongly. I thought it belonged to Emma, my twin sister. Oh. Got it. Now I get why you said you had a memory for two. Yes. You can't imagine to what extent, though. As children, everyone got us mixed up. So one day, we decided to play along. Since then, we have become one and the same. We have officially twin arranged the identity sister. of my sister Emma. Emily Hillsborough. The woman with two faces. <laughs> Clever. The woman with but two isn't it faces. Complicated? How do you make it work? One of us. Uh, by the way, a dentist drill is considered one of the most unpleasant we sounds on earth. First for one, According to that video that we just watched. The other. We dress the same, wear the same makeup, we speak the same. We've learned to act as one. I've already seen this movie. When we accept a mission, we both turn up. This time, though, she went ahead, and I was meant to wait for her on the mainland. She was meant to meet Sir Holm and bring back the details so we could work out who would follow up. And it there was really a problem? Oh, she was sucked. supposed to return from Mortimer's one week ago. So is her twin sister my mother? Up at Plymouth. Wouldn't that make me... Hold on, how old is she? No trace of my sister. Instead, a sailor passed me a message from Holm, notifying me of her sudden disappearance. So, my mother and your sister go missing just a few days apart. That's strange. 
Maybe their disappearances are linked. It's clearly a possibility, but up to now I haven't found a trace of either of them. None of this is very reassuring. By the way, Louis, now that you are in on the secret, you are obliged to keep it to yourself. Or you will pay. You watched the sister or, wait. Don't worry. Your secret is safe with me. Yep. Yeah, at the start of the at the, at the start of the uh It's time to leave. My mother shot her her sister. Right? Interesting. My mother didn't have a hand. Are we gonna get like a hand sawed off sequence here? <laughs> Alright, come on. L l it's time for something crazy to happen, right? I'm, I'm ready for something crazy. So, what do you think of our first adventure? I must admit, it has been fun by your side. Same here. Here it comes. Open the door. Washington is flayed. Uh-oh. Oh, she's been drinking too much again. Louis, I need to talk to you right now. Good evening, Elizabeth. Actually, this is not a good time. I'm begging you, please, don't leave me alone. I'll be waiting for you in your room, but don't be late. What? No, she's gonna search my room. Don't let her go. I was sure there was a certain je ne sais quoi between us. Louis, we need to talk now. Otherwise, it'll be too late. Looks like Elizabeth okay. really needs me, but if I start talking to her, for sure Emily won't wait for me. What should I do? Oh, no. All right. Join Emily or follow Elizabeth. Uh... I don't know. She's got the butterfly tattooed on her, right? That's no. That she's got the Silence of the Lambs moth on her. I don't know if I trust her. This is um. I I don't know if I believe her story here. I'm I'm fairly certain this is probably uh, Ichabod Cranibal Lecter's uh, daughter. We're gonna do a poll on this one. Either we're going to go with Ichabod, Cranibal Lecter, or Emily. It actually is Emily. Emma Watson. Emily Watson. Straw poll. Please vote accordingly. Uh, Emily or Elizabeth. I can't wait till we get to see the previously on the next Game of Thrones. That's my favorite part. Previously on the next Game of Thrones. So I love when they do that. Please vote. Please vote. Looks like Emily is winning by a hair. Oh, Elizabeth is climbing up a little bit here. Hold on. Too close to call at the moment. Too close to call. 48 to 52. Uh-oh. I thought we I thought dude, there was a little there was a quick surge there for Elizabeth that seems to have died down a little bit. Still too close. Now we can't flip a coin, it has to be totally democratic. I'm gonna give this another I'm gonna give this another twenty seconds. <laughs> and ten seconds. I'm about to press the button. Five. Four, three, two, one. That's it. We're going to Emily's room. 
Thank you for voting. It was very close, but remember, it's 51. 51% is a majority. So. Excuse me, Elizabeth, but Done. some very urgent business has cropped up. We can speak tomorrow. No, Louis, don't leave me alone. They've come back. Good night, madam. And we just did the stupidest fucking decision. She's gonna end up dead or something like that. Well, well, Louis, you took your sweet time. What did our poor Elizabeth want? This is not. It's, it, this is why you guys wanted to come back. Um, uh, what what is this? What? Well, I'm supposed to be doing an investigation here. <laughs> the real question would be this: What exactly are you doing, Emily, in my room? Yeah, I no, like for real. Discussions very much, and I had hoped that we could continue them. Emily, God damn have it. I misunderstood something here? What are you doing in my room? And for a while now, God damn it. the question has been nagging at me. And that explains why I quick, now quick, find quick, you quick. here in my bed. Go ahead. Ask me the question that's been burning quick. at your lips. I know your mother was here to meet someone, but I can't figure out who. Oh, so that's what's been hiding behind all this. We are both members of the Order, Louis. Let's try to be honest with each other. Damn it. I have followed with great interest your affair even, in Paris. In connection with Mr. Von Borschert. You managed to steal something from him, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, uh, it's possible. Could, uh... Hmm. I just... I don't want to know. Emily, you suddenly seem to be very interested in my private affairs. What's wrong? Why am I exhausted? You're pumping me for information, are you? Not in the least, God Lily. I'm deeply hurt that you'd even think such a thing of me. Look, I'm sorry. I, I just She's thought that you were wrong. I was interested in you, that's all. But that seems to be beyond you. Don't take it like that. Oh, man, my mother you seem to have dropped your bum device. Old book that Von Burchard was planning to resell on the black market. There. Now you know it all. This is quite fascinating. But just what did Sarah expect to accomplish? Uh, psychology. Here? Psychology. You have used four consumable items during a single quest or consumed a noxious element. Dialogue timer is no longer visible. So I got drunken. So he's, uh, uh, psychology. If only I knew myself. My mother always takes a sly pleasure in telling me as little as possible. <laughs> he oh, told her everything. Louis. Your mother hides things from you. That's not very nice. No, it's not nice at all. And you, what were you supposed to do once the book was found? Give it to our sponsor, of course. Gone. Sir Gregory has more than one card up his sleeve. So you mean home is playing both sides? Right. Enough chatting. Come and join me instead. I mean... It's a damned if you do, damned if you don't situation here. Because uh, if I don't do this, everyone's going to fucking lose their minds and be like, What the fuck? Why are you in here? If I do do this, then I'm, I'm, I'm sniffing up the Twitch police here. Oh, let's, yeah, okay, yeah, sure, okay, let's do a poll. Mm hmm Sounds like a good idea. Yeah, let's I I'm I'll do a poll, I'm not sure. What do you guys want? Hmm. Hmm. Now if I was what what is what is Twitch chat gonna uh, gonna want me to do? Hmm. Oh. Interesting. Uh, 75, uh, 76 percent of the people automatically want me to do that. Hmm. The funny thing is, though, guys, um, here's something you're not understanding. <laughs> I didn't tell you what the poll was. It's opposite day today. We're doing whatever the opposite of this is. So if you get in the bed is the number one vote, then we're not getting in that bed. It's the opposite answer. Gotcha. Didn't even give me a chance to explain the poll. Uh, you voted too quickly. That's on you. You didn't give, give, give me a chance to finish explaining.
Change the vote. I don't think that's possible now. <laughs> oh, sorry, guys. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. We'll do it. We'll do another vote just so everyone can be aware. Of, you know, that we'll do another one. Let's do another poll. Or. Here's the new poll. Uh, it's 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 very 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 clear. So please vote if you could. And the other one, but just please make your choice. <laughs> Figure it out. <laughs> Which one of these is yes? That's on you. Ah, oh, you got it. You got me. The second one is yes. Congratulations. You got it. Let's go. <laughs> They're both yes. to go, Louie. I don't want anyone finding me here in the morning. You're right. Well, have a good night. I mean, of course. Good night. See you tomorrow. Of course they are. What do you think this is? Some kind sure of thing. not incredibly fucking detailed intelligence streamer? You don't think I have these monumentally complex algorithms inside of my brain that can pull them out at any moment? And play you? Any chance that I would like? It's just like the, the amount of education and intelligence that feeds through me. Literally nothing happened. That was such a waste of fucking 15 minutes. <laughs> Did you say that unlocked your iPhone? Oh. <laughs> you said... <laughs> Trait unlocked by fucking. I thought you said that unlocked my iPhone. Oh my god, who is that? It's the guy with the mustache! He was a Gorgonite! Look at all these perfect. I've resolved the enigma of the Medusa. I've discovered Lord Mortimer's room where he hides his treasure. I found out everything. I persuaded everybody. I preferred everybody. And I, I spent the night with everybody. Let's uh let's get politics up so we can at least have the option. Politics and etiquette, I would say. Mm. Eleven points to the next level. I mean, might as just might as well get them to level two. I hate missing the option. You know. At one point, uh, let's. I want this. Just every time we get some extra points.
Jeff from Psychology. He he, you know. <laughs> Why am I laughing at that? Don't laugh at that. I should not be chuckling at this. My eye got better? Yeah, it did. Good. I beat the game. Wait, hold up, we have to see our progress, right? You know, at the end screen it shows you all your choices and everything that happened to you. There was no murder in this murder mystery. <laughs> My title has been incorrect for three hours. No, this is episode one. It's gonna be like a five episode series. Okay, here we go. No, don't like show my fucking credit card. <laughs> Why? Yikes. That could have been pretty bad. Uh Where's my I can't see the my options? Okay. Identity stolen. <laughs> Alright, well we can do this. Let me just uh, let me just take a piss. We'll open up uh, Burnout Remastered. Let me change the stream title. That was um I mean interesting concept. The game's an interesting concept. It's I don't gonna need gonna need like two another two or three episodes more of this to figure out how, how I like this or not. I like the George Washingtons in the game. I mean like cool, I guess. That's it. Um that's pretty much it, yeah. So there, there are, there's my my current review for episode one. Uh, George Washington's in the game. Uh, cool, I guess. Okay. Well, maybe after episode two, maybe we'll maybe we'll find out. Now let's uh, change to Burnout Remastered. Uh, what, what's what's a good stream title? I'm sure that a lot of these are gonna make more sense as we go. Uh, Burnout. Remastered Burnout. Hmm. Uh, Remastered. Burnout Remastered, I guess. How about Burnout Remastered on? That sucks, right? No, uh, yeah, it's like a burnout uh, giant mammal. First person, no, we need, need a Burnout Remastered on is fine, I don't care. Is it even on Twitch? Burnout Paradise. Is anybody even playing this game? Did it just come out? No one's playing this game. Alright, let me, um, I'll be right back, I'm just gonna pee. I'll see you guys in, like, one or two minutes, we'll play some Burnout for like an hour or two. And we'll go from there. See you soon. By the way, if you don't, if this is why the only reason why you're here, tomorrow night is a way out that co-op escape prison game. I'm gonna play it with Italics. Should be a lot of fun. We've been really looking forward to that game, so if there's a stream that you don't want to miss, you probably don't want to miss tomorrow night. Friday night. It's gonna be crazy. Don't say that shit. I'm not gonna tell you that's what it's gonna be crazy. Oh, it's gonna be so crazy. No, don't say that. It might be terrible. It might be the most boring stream you've ever seen in your life. It might be the worst stream you've ever seen. But it's gonna it might be fun. I'll be right back. <laughs>